Oh my goodness. There are times when I absolutely hate OBS. Uh, everything was fine. Everything was hunky dory. Everything was wonderful. And then suddenly, boom, uh, OBS decided that it wasn't going to recognize my microphone again. So I've just had to completely reboot my PC and reset up the whole of the stream because obviously I'd started it running and I had to redo everything. But now it does look at long last as if it is working. Um, not expecting too many people uh, to find me right now because, well, I'm not supposed to be streaming now. I'm supposed to be on around about half past seven. Um, but Jack Kobe is joining us. He's in a different car than he's been racing and we were going to get together at six o'clock. Um, he's got late in from his trip. Lauren's door lock took me a heck of a longer than I expected it to take. So we're both running just a little bit late. But there we go. There we go. Um, still got a few people in the chat already. Um, John Winkles, good afternoon. I need to say good evening. Uh, M1M Racing, a good afternoon. Reese, good afternoon. I hope that you are all well. Uh, John, I was wondering if after all these hours you like to meet. Um, yeah hit me up on discord and um if we're local i don't have a problem with that that would be good um yeah okay right um where are we so at the moment what i want we're going to be doing the stcc race um the schedule for that is it starts at half past seven when we have half an hour of practice we're then supposed to be kicking off bang on eight o'clock racing both the feature race and the sprint race and then we will be heading into the lobbies racing with my friends in the bmw um, m3 sport evolution uh, 89 i think it is car which will be running most of the night so quite a varied evening this evening um and we'll see how we go now joe and lauren are both away in barcelona for real this evening so they're actually out there now partying and having fun there's about 11 of us gone on hendu uh have, well, 11 of them are gone on a hendu and i'm here racing barcelona um on gran turismo which is a bit ironic really um, but it does mean that i'm looking after coda on my own this evening so if i do need to go and sort dog out and things like that then there may well be a little bit of a break but i hope everybody's having a really great day today and um, I might even see some of you online tomorrow as it's my plan to get into the daily races tomorrow. Uh, I'm not sure if Jack is going to be catching up with us, but I am going to head out on track and just try and get a little bit of practice in this car, get things settled down, get my nerves settled as well for a little bit later on. Right. Here we go. Headphones on. so We can hear what's going on. And obviously I could be a little bit quiet whilst I am initially racing because uh, obviously what I'm trying to do is um, trying to get a better time and trying to make sure that I do well because we did pretty well when we did round one. Um, we're heading up the table, believe it or not. Really cannot believe I'm saying that. Honest to goodness, I am yeah, really, really, really surprised that that's happening. Um and there are some good, good, good people coming into um, coming into the race today. So it is going to be rather, rather interesting. See what I do want to do. Let's just come out of there. What setup have I got on this car? So I've got racing mediums. I actually want to I want to go on racing cards because I really do need to get to grips with those tires. And. Um, and uh, is that lost? I am not sure. I'm going to go with that setup. I'm having real problems with setups saving in Gran Turismo at the moment. I don't know what it is. I, I set them up and then when I come to use them, I can't. I don't quite understand why.
Now, as I said, I could be quite quiet whilst I'm trying to concentrate in this one. I could be quite quiet all the way up to nine o'clock. They were half an hour late already. Well, a little over half an hour late. So I guess that's saving my voice for half an hour. <laughs> well, I could have done without the stress of trying to get the uh, technical difficulties sorted out. OK, and when Emma's saying you go and normally got to do all the settings each time. Um, the thing is, I did have them written down when Jack gave me them and I cannot find them now. Oh, I've got the wrong track. What have I done? What have I done? I've got the wrong track. Edit event settings. That caught me out. <laughs> we want to do the one without the chicane. That's the one. Let's try that again. <laughs> oh, my word. It's going to be one of those days. One of those days. One of those days. Um, let's just go to track. Just do some practice. Um, anyone? And yeah, I, I. I should do. Uh, Fargo, yes, early practice. I, I should. I should look at them uh, and get them. The only issue that i've got is the last couple of nights when i've raced this i thought i was racing jack's setup and i want to do the other tires don't i um i thought i was running jack's setup and i haven't been um my concern now is if i put that other setup on where the um where the back end is really loose i stand a risk of throwing a race away so I know he's going to kill me and I know I'll I'll rightly get an ear bashing for it. Uh, but I think I'm going to run just with the standard setup that I've been used to and um, just make sure that I can bring it home. Because that's the main thing. If I can just bring this home mid table in these two races today, I'll be quite happy. Uh, in fact, we're off to San Croix in a week's time. And that's another track that I do not know. So it's yet another one I've got to learn uh over the course of a week so jackie dotona is really testing me we had uh brands hatch initially a track that many of you that have raced with me will know i uh, really struggle with barcelona was an absolute no gear area for me for the longest time and san croix is a track that i really do not know um i've probably raced that about three or four times for the world circuit races and then that was it i don't think i've uh, sort of gone back to that one but it's it's nice that this is encouraging us to learn new tracks and try not to get penalties need to cut that one a little bit more then my name is off to get ready Good luck as well later on, my friend. Well, I'm saying that as long as you don't beat me. <laughs> no, good luck. I'm hoping we all do well. Above all, I hope we all have fun. M1M, if you want to drop into the lobby and practice, feel free. You've got no game sound. Hmm. We've got some real problems with OBS this evening. Some real problems with OBS this evening.
Okay, at least I now seem to know how to fix them when it goes wrong. That's about the only good thing. <laughs> um, for any of you that are doing stuff with OBS, if you find that your one of your um, sources start failing, um, what I do is I just double click on it, go into the properties and just re-pick it. So for the microphone, I ju it just go into that one on both the microphone and the audio. It had come up and it was just saying um, default. And I just went in there and re-picked it. So it's almost like it's lost the microphone and then had to do it again. And for that one, it lost the... It's weird. It got the Elgato um, video, but not the sound. Most strange. Most strange. Okay. Uh, my, is my, does my DJI microphone sound all right? Because it's looking like it's clipping really, really badly today. As it's way up in the red. Even though they're the same okay that's good okay, it's the same settings i always use because i've written them down now but it's like up in the red all the time but uh, sds thank you for mentioning that i appreciate that so weirdly and i couldn't one work out why the little um i've got these little bars that go up and down as i'm talking and as the game sound is running and um, they were both working, so I don't know what's up with OBS this evening. As I said before, it's the bane of my life, OBS. I've got a love-hate relationship with it. Thank you, Synth. Oh no, cut that more, cut that more. Um, the only reason I'm on early is because <laughs> while well, the cat's away the mice will play as I say and uh, I jumped on because Jack Kobe is going to be racing with us this evening uh, and he's been drawn a car that he's not used to and he was going to jump on with me and we were just going to do some running together just so that he can get a set up and get his car sorted out and get a feel for it because obviously he's been running the Sylvia uh, as am I, but he's been drawn a different car. I think he's got the Mazda Atenza, I think. Don't hold me to that. Uh, and it's a car that he's not used to. So, uh, but unfortunately, it looks like he's been out and didn't get back until late. And I was a few minutes late because I was trying to sort out Lauren's door, which took me a lot longer than I expected to fix. And then I had technical issues with OBS. <laughs> so... <laughs> For the pair of us, things have really not worked out well today. And uh, maybe that is a sign of how things are going to go in the race. Who knows? We shall see. Uh, but I've been on, joined on board with Synth. So good afternoon, my friend. And I did jump on board um, the PlayStation a little bit earlier on today i have brilliant two or three uh, two races two brilliant races with uh, a french guy and uh we were in the bmw vgt one of my favorite games in the car in an old game and uh, i am strongly considering doing an evening a friday night in the bmw vgt it's an awesome car handles a bit like a gr3 but it's just just i just love it it's a brilliant 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 car to worry 152s i need to be getting that down near the 150s good evening college to tom how are you my friend i hope you're well 
Oh dear. The singer Mitchell's come out. That's that can't bode well, can it? Uh, Reese, the lobby is going to be well. The one we're doing at the moment, anybody can come and join in. Then at half past seven, I'm going to be switching over to playwright and Jack Kobe's lobby for the actual race itself. Then around about nine o'clock or whenever we finish the STCC races, I'll be opening up another lobby. So this one will close. I'll be opening up a fresh one, which will be the BMW night. And we're going to be heading off in the BMW M3 Sport Evolution, the 1980s model. And that's the car that we're going to be running this evening all night long at different tracks. So that's the setup for this evening, my friend. So at the moment, I'm just getting, as you can see, some much needed work in. I'm just running on these hard tyres again. Uh, which are the ones that have really scuppered me because I've been struggling with them. Although, I'm not going to lie, this car feels a little bit more... Trying a different line through there. A little bit more planted. Um, it's not quite as quick as Jack Kobe's um, setup, if I'm honest. But it is, it's, it's more stable. And I'm really in two minds. I'd like to do well, in which case Jack's set up, I should be running, but also I don't really want to be spinning it and I'd rather come mid-table tonight rather than absolutely last if I spin it. And there's still no guarantee I'm going to be mid-table of course, because there's some really good racers in this, uh, or racers in this championship now, some big names coming in. And I think I'm only sitting top of the table at the moment because Dan only did the feature race. He didn't do the sprint race. And Kuro had a mare of a um, feature race and then blitzed the sprint race. And um, somehow I managed to get a fastest lap. And it, it all just came good. I don't know what happened on the night at, at Brands. Uh, it's quite a few people going off. But I have been featuring this race in my lobbies for the last two weeks or so. And there's a lot of people now really, really well prepared for this race. So um, whilst I'm hoping I can put a half decent performance in, I am not counting my chickens at all. And I wouldn't be surprised if I am down towards the back of the, uh, the grid the end of the two races in addition a few people have said to me that the Sylvia is not great around this track but I've been watching Jack Kobe blitz everybody in the Sylvia this week so I think it's got as good a chance as any other car out there if I'm perfectly honest where are we on 52 53s I need to be nearer the 150s this is too slow Well, I'd like to be in the ballpark of the the 150s. That said, if I can put in, you know, a 152 constantly, a 151, 152, then uh, that will please me no end. But we shall see. least I do seem to be keeping this going in the same in the right direction on these hard tires now not overly quick but what I'm aiming to do is just keep it pointing in the right direction and that way if I can just stay with people in the early part of the race or at least just stay with the back of the pack then hopefully I'll be able to make up some time once I get those soft tires on Quite an aggressive strategy I'm going with again tonight. A lot of people have told me to go longer on the uh, on the hard tyres, but I am pretty much setting what I'm going to do. 
Whether it is right or whether it's wrong, well, we will find out on the day. It does seem to be something that is different to what other people are doing. And if that is the case, I'm happy because one of the things I'm hoping for is that might put me uh, in some clean air. And if that happens, that'll all be good. We're going to have to wait and see. So back in the 152s. Map Mike is on track. Map Mike is quick around here. Synth is not slow either. I mean, I'm trying to chase him down. And he's still 0 0.6, 0 0.7 seconds away. Mikey, are you not running in the race this evening? I thought you were entered for it. Hi, Kane. How you doing, Kian? I'm not doing too bad. I would prefer to have this in the uh, in the 150 zeros, but I'm about two seconds slower than I would like at the moment. But we are at least keeping this car pointing in the the right direction on these hard tyres, and that's all good. Yeah, I was supposed to be coming on with Jack. Jack Kobe has got one of the spaces at the STCC that we're racing this evening. And he's been running in the Silver all week, well, for the last two weeks. But he's been drawn to drive the Mazda Tenza. And he was going to come on with me at six o'clock and see if he could get a set up sorted out. And he, he may well be doing that on his own, but uh, he got in late from a trip this afternoon. I had technical issues when I first set up the stream and it's sort of not happened so um, but I've, I've jumped on anyway just to get some laps in this uh, Sylvia on the hard tyres and just try and just build my confidence and get ready for the race this evening a lot of you that follow me will know I'm pretty it, it takes me a few minutes to get settled down It's open at the moment, which friends, like it's a French lobby, one of my normals. So you are more than welcome to jump in for the next, what, half an hour. And then I'll be closing it down, joining Playwrights lobby with Jack Co uh, uh, Jackie Detona. And then we'll be into the actual Super Touring Car Championship. That's too deep uh, for real. And then once we've done that, We'll be heading into my own lobby for some um, racing in a BMW later on. Just trying a few different things around here for the moment. I probably will result back or result resort back to what I have been doing in the week. Uh, so that's a 152 four. Thank you, Ken. Reese, I'm hoping it's going to be um, pretty quick. Uh, when they set it up, it was supposed to be start promptly at eight, so we'll be done by about nine. Um, but it was the first round. There was a little bit of sorting out, so hopefully this time we'll we'll get running quickly and get done for nine o'clock. But obviously, it is um, out of my control and it's it is what it is i'm not going to start worrying about it it's 
still not sure whether second or th third is better through there. exploring the track limits a little bit as well gonna have to be careful of those in the actual race Wow, four blues and a 151. Get in there. Yes. Woo, can I do that again? <laughs> Only thing is, I've got a penalty to serve. But that was only the slightest, slightest um corner cut so it just goes to show that uh, you know whoa, whoa, another one is a there is a 151 in there on these hard tires so i think if i could do 151s 152s i'll be relatively happy and uh, that should suffice for the strategy all being well see these tires are starting to slide around a little bit now i will not be letting the hard tires get anywhere near this level i mean we've done nine laps on the hard tires uh, we're going to be doing a fraction of that in the race so what i might do is just come in and get these changed right it's only ball keeps saying look for the apexes which will look for the apexes out of one corner look for the apex think about where your tyres got to run over that kerb get the car positioned coming to here comes down hard on the brakes get it turned in don't hit the wall I've done that a few times right let's put another set of hards on I've gone through quite a bit of fuel. Oh. So she thinks he's getting one forty nine on softs. That's all right. That's good. That's not too bad. Oh, sorry for rubbing my nose there's loads of people around here that have been cutting the grass today and i normally get hay fever in the summer but my eyes and my nose kicked off earlier on uh, i've got my eyes under control thankfully uh, but my nose has been streaming all day long Yeah, Baz, Joe and Lauren are, this is really weird actually, I don't know if you heard. Joe and Lauren are actually in Barcelona for real. They're at a Hendu, Ellie's Hendu, my youngest Hendu. And they're in Barcelona for real, partying. And I'm racing at Barcelona on Gran Turismo. How crazy is that? just trying to chill while I do this I'm trying not to get too stressed too worried uh, with this one it is going to be what it is uh, I'm not expecting for a repeat of uh, Brands Hatch 
especially given how many uh, really really quick racers are in the uh, race this uh, this week uh, Faz just for a heads up I'm only going to be on for another 25 minutes and then I'm going to be heading over to Playwright's server and their lobby uh, to do proper practice um, in their room which will all be set up with all the weather and everything else so uh, I'll only be around for about another half hour then we'll be diving on to playwright server doing the races and then we'll be back with my lobby and the BMW M Sport Evolution at around about nine o'clock and they say around about nine o'clock because we've got to finish the playwright for the, uh, the STCC races and then I am going to need to walk code up very very quickly before I start my own lobby so as Rhys says it all depends on how quickly we get underway with the STCC or oh, have I cut that one might just cut that I'm pushing track limits at the minute just exploring the track limits Um, come in what I say now yeah I've got to walk the dog and stuff so hopefully we it will be quicker starting than it was a few weeks ago and we'll get done but uh, I am going to be dictated to by things that are out of my control tonight it is what it is Oh, I didn't get on the power then. Oh, picked up a track limit on that one. Not quite sure where and why. That was a 152.3 though. So the strategy that I've gone for is basically a, a mid to back of pack strategy and I don't for one minute think that I'm going to be anywhere near the front and I'm hoping that that strategy is going to pan out for me and um, I might be able to pick up a few places based on tyre wear but we shall see. Let's hope I don't make the same mistake that I made in the week and come in on the wrong lap. Right, so we've got a half second penalty there, which is basically going to cost about a second. And compromise this corner. Actually, it didn't compromise it too much, I don't think. gravel 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 just trying to find an extra little couple of tents in that last corner there's a lot of people that are getting through that corner quicker than me and getting down the straights I've analyzed and analyzed and analyzed the videos and whether it is a characteristic of this car or not I've gone too deep there whether it's a characteristic of the car or not I cannot go through those corners as quick as a lot of other people which is costing me time down the straights and although Jackie, um, Jack, they, uh, bleh, Jack Covey has been winning all week in this car around here, uh, a few people have said to me that the Sylvia is not the best car for this track. And I'm wondering if that is it. It's getting the speed off of that last corner. But when I look at the times that Jack has been putting in for the last week or two, I cannot get away from the fact that it should be able to do it. But 
that's the other thing I've got to be careful of is spinning it. This is why I'm practicing on these hard tyres because when I get into the point where I'm pushing, I am losing the back end occasionally and also um, letting the front end drift a little bit, which then costs me, as you've seen, with the track limit issues. So, and I don't want to be picking up track limit penalties if I can help it. Is that a track limit or did I get away with that? So I need to be accelerating much, much earlier through that corner. Um, I'm going to try something a little bit different on this lap. One of the things I tried was just leaving my brake in a little bit later on that one. That did not pay off. That did not pay off at all. too hasty to get the power down through there. There's nobody behind me, so I'm just gonna carry on through here. So that's about a second lost. Plus it messes you up for that corner as well, which I've overcooked and I've got a penalty going through there as well. What I'm interested in is this corner, this little section at the end here. Where are we? 20 minutes to run. Hey Galactico and Thugs, good evening, well, good afternoon. I keep saying good evening, it's afternoon. Good afternoon my friends. Oh, brain fog moment, what's that for TW? I can think of something rude, but I'm hoping it isn't that. And I can't say that on the channel. <laughs> I'll break all my decency rules and my respectfulness rules. <laughs> oh, for the win. Oh, no, no. Yeah, thank you, but that's not going to happen. <laughs> that isn't going to happen tonight. Um, uh, Dan. Uh, yeah, Dan is running and Jack Kobe is running. Um, Kuro is also running. These are all really quick races and there's a number of other really quick people in there. So I'm really playing for mid-table would be good. I wouldn't be surprised if I'm towards the back tonight, but mid-table would be... I would be pleased if I could get mid-table. Mid a win would be outstanding and we'll go for it. Of course, we'll go for it. But I have to be a little bit <laughs> realistic as well uh, with my expectations. And also that feeds into the management of my race as well. That wasn't good. That was not good. I can come further down there. I'm gonna cause problems. What I'm trying to do is break at the beginning of that sausage curve to get the power on earlier it's not working all I'm going to do is I'm going to wind up 
catching somebody out and they're going to bump me halfway down the sausage and I'm going to wind up in the barrier. So I think uh, I need to just rethink that and race it as I have been doing all week. And if I'm not overly quick out of that corner, it's just too bad. I think I should be stacking gear through there. I know why I got that one. Good evening, Matt. How are you doing? was a bit little bit better yeah mate I need all the practice I can get and you'll notice it's all on hard tires as well this is just practicing in my own lobby I will be heading over to uh, Jackie Daytona and playwrights lobby in about 15 minutes time Oh, I got a nice juicy burger. Ooh, I've had pine chips tonight. Uh, the missus and my eldest are away this weekend. They're at my youngest Hindu. So I'm all on my own with Coda. So I've had uh, a few things to get sorted out, but now I'm all on my own. I've done my own tea. got a few chores to do in the morning and then I'm hoping to dive into the um, daily races tomorrow I I did a couple of daily races the other night but the first daily races I've done in weeks and um, I'm hoping to spend a fair chunk of time tomorrow in the daily so I've got a few little chores to do and we gate crash for a party uh, I'm not much of a party animal, so uh, the party's going on in Barcelona. So you're in the wrong place, my friend. Uh, but you are certainly welcome to join me on the live stream tomorrow. Oh, tell me about it. Yeah, they've all headed off to Barcelona. Uh, don't talk to me about how much it's all costing. <laughs> There's been so many arguments about the whole thing. It's uh, insane. Thankfully, I got out the stag do. Uh, that's uh, another overseas trip, but it's not my sort of thing, really. Right, well there's quite a few runs on the uh, hard tyres, looking a little bit better. I've got these down into the 152s, I've had a couple of 151s. Uh, above all, we're not spinning it every 30 seconds, as I was doing earlier. So, uh, as in earlier in the week. feeling a little bit more confident and obviously once we go onto the sauce and medium that's going to give me even more grip more confidence and hopefully we'll be able to push it on those tires with uh, any luck see if we can make up a few places evening Jack where are you <laughs> you need to put some time in on that that man star however knowing you you're going to do the half hour in playwrights practice session 
and I bet you're probably going to nail it. Right, did that get a penalty? Synth, if you're getting 151s on the hards, that's pretty good because I'm struggling to get the 151s. Oh, thugs. Jack does not need to spy on me. I've been spying on him all week. I've been saving replays and I've sat for far many more minutes than I care to admit to watching his lines, watching where he breaks, watching where he turns and it's found me about three or four seconds, don't get me wrong, but I'm still nowhere near nowhere near where I need to be the guy is a complete alien around here, if that's the right word I prefer the word genius. Um, I just feel a little bit sorry for him though because he's been running this race for the last two weeks in the Sylvia and now suddenly he's jumping into a different car. I think that is going to be a test of character and skill which I'm really looking forward to seeing if I'm perfectly honest. Ah, Fargo, yeah, that would be fun. I did consider trying to bribe uh, Jackie to um, not let Jack run, but I thought better of it. <laughs> no, it's, it's all good. It's going to be good. It's going to be really good. And I love racing against people who are just so much better than me because it makes you work so much harder and you learn more, you try harder. And yeah, it's going to be fun. We've got some quick races in here tonight. Yes, a 151.7 and it counts. No jumping of curbs. And then I go too deep into that one. Got a red for sector one now on the timing screen. Oh, Mr. Gear there. I didn't want to change up. So this one's almost definitely going to be red as well. A cow trial pit stop. I know why I got a penalty on that one and that's something else I need to stop doing on that corner. Whoa, big slide there, under power. Don't hit the wall, don't hit the wall, don't hit the wall. Don't hit the wall. Woo! Um, race the car. I'm assuming you're talking about Jack. Jack is in the um, Master Atenza. Which looks to be quite a decent car around here, if I'm honest. It does look to be pretty decent. Hey, uh, Fargo, enjoy your pizza. What have you got on it? T 
tell you what I should have done. I should have come out of there on the medium, shouldn't I? Practice the exit. Thank you, Gamer Dan. Are you running it for this one tonight? Mushroom and truffle, hey? Whoa. Oh, I might cut that one. Let's see if that ticks up to one second. Oh, it looks like we got away with it. Okay. Fine lines on that corner if you want to cut it. Too deep, too deep, too deep. That's going to let a car up the inside. And then a back end slide. Whoa! That's in the wall. Uh, I was just trying to get in there super, super, super quick. Okay, gamer. For some reason, I thought you were. Um, so we're going to come out on the racing soft tyres. Let's see how we do coming out on these. Where are we? Uh, 24 minutes past. Yeah, going in, coming into the pitch, you've got to be really, really careful. You don't hit that wall. Otherwise, it is game over. Seriously game over. Right, where's my breaking point when I come down the back? Watch the white line. I think that's about as good as I am going to do getting out of there. God, a grip. The grip that you've got now is immense. It's just a totally different car now. The confidence that this gives you once you're on the soft tyres. about four minutes and then we will be going across to the other server it still bugs me that I'm driving around in a Nissan Silvia with a Peugeot badge on the front and a Peugeot livery it's just it's messing with my head
Oh, a bit of a slide there. Cars are still a little bit cold. Even though come out of tyre blankets, still cold. Should be further over to the left there, really. Open up the corner a little bit more. Then we're off to San Juan for the next one, which I thought somebody was winding me up about uh, when they mentioned it, because we did Brands Hatch, which is one of my terrible tracks. We then did Barcelona, which is one of my worst tracks. And then we're off to San Juan, which is a track that I think I've only run about two or three times for the World Circuit races. Otherwise, I don't think I've barely run it. So that's a whole new track I've got to learn for next Friday. I'm just hoping I'm not alone in that and there's a few others that have got to learn it as well. might have cut that I'm just again just experimenting with one or two of these uh, corners just to see where the limits are Looks so we might have got away with that hey 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 Uh, just a reminder that when I'm qualifying and racing, I am going to be a very, very quiet. Oh. Is that a penalty? I think it might be. We got away with that one as well. Dan, thank you. You too, my friend. Are you doing both of the races tonight? I'm hoping you are. Actually. I don't know if I mean that or not. <laughs> no, I do. I hope you do both of them tonight. I think you only did one last week. Oh, not last week. The last time we ran. Ah, cool. Yeah, Jack's going to be doing the uh, the old uh, doodly bug, isn't he? The old commentary. All right, guys, I'm really sorry for those of you that are running, but I am closing this out now. I don't know if this then goes off to somebody else. Or whether it actually actually disappears but uh, there we go uh, good luck to everybody that is going to be racing this evening i really hope that you do well and um, i'll see you on the other side um, hopefully this will then become somebody else's lobby but i'm not quite sure how it works in fairness um Jack Kobe saying, was this car is so much different? Uh, so if you allow, um, I assume that means that the car he's going in is so much different to the Sylvia. Uh, I've been told that the Mazda is a lot better. Uh, Mad Mikey, I thought that might be the case. I used to like it when it passed it over to another lobby person. Uh, that used to be really, really nice. Um, it 
it's got to be that one, isn't it? Must be. Canis Rex. We in the right room. Kuro's in. Jackie, it has got to be the right room. Yeah, it must be right. Must be right. Um, okay, so we need car settings. We'll go racing hard. So, uh, for those of you that are not aware, um, we are doing a 12-lap race at Barcelona without the chicane, uh, as in the final chicane. And uh, we have to run both the racing hard and the racing soft tyres. It is a split strategy. Half the field, the last time we did this, ran the, the one compound first, the other compound second. Half the field did it the other way around. And um, it proved to be very, very, very interesting. I have a strategy in my head that I want to play. Um, and I'm hoping that that is going to pan out. Who knows? We really don't know. Uh, a few people have told me that the... Nissan that I'm running is not the quickest of cars around here. However, I've watched Jackie Daytona for the last two weeks monster the lobby races that we've done around here, uh, winning very often by over a second in the Sylvia. Um, unfortunately, Jack is, as you can see on the screen there, he's in the Atenza, the GR4 Atenza. Um, so this is a brand new car for him, which is going to be, it's got to mess with his head. Because he's been running the Sylvia for the longest time. And now suddenly, boom, he's in a different car. So that's going to be a real test of his mental agility and, and racing skills. Uh, Kuro is in the WRX four-wheel drive, which he doesn't like. Uh, he had terrible trouble in the first race last week. Uh, not last week, but two or three weeks ago. Um... But he monstered it in the second. In the sprint race, he came first by country mile. Uh, as you can see there, um, M1M is uh, in the Lancia Evolution. That was one of the other cars that I was really hoping to get. But the, the four-wheel drive tyres do seem to be really eating their tyres um, quite a bit. Uh, Jackie Daytona is in the Alpha. I had two amazing races at, at Brands Hatch with Jackie Daytona. Uh, pressure of chasing the person that actually set this whole thing up was immense and I was scared stiff of, of hitting him uh, but we had some brilliant brilliant races and um, well we'll see what happens in this one uh, you then got me and it looks like we've uh, we got Colin de Tom has joined us um, in the Veyron uh, uh, Colin de Tom is a brilliant racer as well uh, Nixta85 Gaming and Carlos, Carlos Fandango has been running with me for the last two weeks as well to get practice uh, very very quick uh, and Carlos has got quicker and quicker and quicker so um, yeah it's it gets interesting um, it will get interesting to see how things go uh, since we last raced Kuro has got A plus um so i've congratulated him before but well done kuro for getting a plus and keeping a plus uh, i hope you're feeling better kuro is carrying a really 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 heavy cold at the moment uh actually be very surprised um i am actually quite surprised he's racing at all this evening if i'm quite honest so um my respect to you young sir uh probably not listening um, but my respect to you, Kuro, for racing with uh, COVID and his like, burning from the inside out. On the, the Discord earlier on, he put a picture of somebody on fire. That was how he was feeling. Um, so, yeah, it's um, it's going to be interesting. It's going to be a very, very interesting one. Very interesting indeed. Right. Anyway, I am here to... to um, race i am going to be going quiet um everyone's just asking you streaming so ooh, i'm just going to reply uh 
I am... Uh. I'm already getting nervous. Already. I can't even spell streaming. I am... My heart is going. I'm sweating like crazy. And... Um, yeah. Just... Nervous, nervous, nervous. Nervous, nervous, nervous. So, at this point, I am going to go very quiet on the chat. Um, if you do want my attention, then please put at PlayStation Racer um, up on the board so that you do get my attention. Otherwise, um, I'm going to be very quiet. Welsh boy, thank you. That's where we see whether the conditions I've been running are uh, going to pay dividends or whether it's going to cause problems. Wow, well, Jackie, and I was told that the Sylvia was slow around here. Why is it, why is it that this car feels so different? This car suddenly feels so much different to when I've been running it in my own lobbies. why I need to put the time in now. Yeah, Dan, I might actually just um, knock it back a bit. Thing is, I've been trying to go with. Um, no, I'm, I need to stick with zero because under the um, soft tyres, I might need to push it to the rear. Um, if the tyres start going away too much, so I think I want to try and keep it to zero if I can at the moment. Whoa. That's a good question, Captain. I don't actually know how to check any of that. I think it is just what it is. I think that's a penalty. Yeah, I thought it was. 
So I can't cut, cannot cut it that fast. Okay. And that's why I wouldn't know how to adjust it. <laughs> I think there may well be a, uh, I think that the, the basis of that question was track temperature because of time of day and conditions. Now this is interesting because most of the boys around me are all on the soft tyres. Oh, there we go. This is what I'm afraid of. He's losing that back end. Kuro, I agree with you. It does feel so much different. I don't understand why. I'm having to be a little bit cautious about how I'm putting the power down. But hey ho, we've got um, we've got about a quarter of an hour to get on top of this. And I'm chasing down Aid, who's no slouch. He's a quick old driver. So I've got somebody very good to chase. And I'm gonna assume that Aid is on the soft tire. Maybe thugs, don't even know if we've got wind direction in Grand Turismo 7. It might really just be me, you know, it might be nerves. It could just be my nerves, my confidence coming out. Uh, for those of you that don't know me in a situation like this, all sorts of confidence starts kicking in and I have big confidence problems, questioning my own ability, waiting for something to go wrong and um, whilst I try and keep positive it all goes a little bit negative but um, we'll see how we go. Hey Dan a man is in the room, Dan monstered the first race last uh, two or three weeks ago when we lasted this I'm looking forward to seeing the likes of Dan, Jack, Kuro fighting up the front and others. I'm racing so I apologise for anybody that I didn't mention. Again for those of you that follow me I'm hoping for a mid table on this one. I can get mid table I'll be relatively happy oh no aid has just gone in Who have I got in front now? Oh, big old slide through there. Oh, shoo me, I wish. But not with the calibre of drivers that we got in this lobby. And we're off to San Juan next, which is a track that I've got very, very little experience on.
Oh, has that gone too far off the track? Might have got away with that one. Oh, yeah, yeah, big slide. Oh, I'm going to have to look and see which San Qua we're doing. I bet it's the full track, though. Kuro, do you know which San Qua track we're doing? I'm asking you questions when you're supposed to be practicing. That's not very fair. It's B. Okay. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I had a feeling it was going to be the big one. Chasing down mint detail, another quick racer. Don't know which tyres he's on though. Oh, that's a corner cut, that one. Cut that a little bit too much that time. Pretty sure. I'd be amazed if it doesn't. Catching him. Where are we? Point one of a second. Well, two. Point point one. No, that's to aid. Oh no 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 no! It's in the gravel. It's annoying because not only do you get slowed down for the gravel, but you also very often get a corner cut there as well. So you get a penalty on a penalty. I wonder if he's got penalties turned off at the moment. Because I'm surprised I'm not getting any penalties. I wonder if he's got them turned off for the practice. Um, I need to do a proper, proper corner cut in a moment and see if that is the case. sliding too much that's why my front tires have got more more tire wear than I'm used to right big old corner cut this time just let Kuro through now if that isn't a corner cut I don't know what is that should be a corner cut too should have a barrel load of track limit penalties and I've got none oh no that's a pain hi Ashley hello Drac sorry I'm not watching the um, chat too much at the moment guys hello Shumi Thank you for the good luck. I've been experimenting with track limits and I think I've just proved that Jackie's got track limits turned off for the practice, which is a bit of a shame. Incidentally, I haven't got my key light on, so the only light I've got is from my TV. Um, I don't know how that is looking on the on the video. Um, 
but I don't want the distraction of that light up there and uh, that's the reason why that is off and the light on the video is probably not quite as good as it usually is but this is how serious it is it's like every little thing that I can do to try and get rid of distractions to just try and keep my mind more and more and more and more on the job in hand the only thing I'm not going to do is turn off the stream and cut you guys off out of the chat otherwise everything else I'm trying to push out of my mind worrying is how many people are actually out on track doing hot laps that's in that barrier again <laughs> I need to practice that in more oh you're getting trap penalties Matt how come I wasn't then how on earth was I not getting any track limit penalties I was going too slow. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> See, if you're going off track, you can avoid the track penalty by going slow. Interesting. Interesting. Is that a way of tricking the game? Well, I knew I was going to cut across the... Uh, the pit lane I because I whacked the barrier so not only when you go into that barrier does it cost you mahusively because you've got to reverse out of it but also you get a four and a half second penalty it's horrendous it is a it's a game over race if you do that it is the one thing you really do not want to be doing I got it's been a go problem is you want to get into the pits quick but I have seen a few people wall riding but I don't think that's really fair and I don't want to do that to look at the penalty it's like bye bye Carlos See you sometime next Friday. we doing we've got about four minutes before this is all going to start kicking off and then I am going to need to drop on to the um, see what I am going to do or oh, I'm going to be back in a couple of minutes because I'm going to visit the little boys room before we start because I've been drinking like crazy not the boozy stuff uh, just a bit of Dr Pepper and water I don't want to get caught whilst I'm racing, so I'll be back in just a moment.
another little job to do as well. There is another little job to do. Come on, quick, quick, quick. Yeah, shoot me. I normally put a little video on, but um, I didn't today. <laughs> um, all right, shift. Uh, but, 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 so we want this one here. We we'll join this room. Oh, the nerves are kicking in. The curtain, no nerves, the nerves, the nerves. Racing hard tyres. Enter. Oh, good idea, Welsh boy. Brilliant, brilliant idea. Thank you for the. Uh, thank you for that. Just done. Just done. So that's oil changed. The right tyres. Actually, I'm on the wrong tyres for the moment. Let's just go back onto the uh, racing soft tyres. I'm going to have to remember to change those at the end of the qualifying. Um, so the TV's done, the oil's done, the tyres are done. Uh, qualifying at 8.05, so we've got five minutes. I'm just going to... I'm just going to relax for the moment. I am just going to relax and I'm going to have a wagon wheel. Yes, a wagon wheel. <laughs> That's an advert for wagon wheels. How many times can I say wagon wheels in one minute? I apologise for eating on the stream. Oh boy. We should have most people in. It looks like we're still too light. Leroy's out in the Mitsubishi in the Jason Plato livery car. All of the uh, cars have got British touring car liveries. Uh, M1M is in the Rydell livery car. Again, the other Mitsubishi. That was a Volvo back in the day. You'd never have guessed it. Jack Kobe has just jumped into the Mazda Atenza and that is in the old livery, uh, the Renault livery. Um, that was Jason Plato's car. That's a nice car to be in, that one, I think. Although he says it's handled really badly and he's way off the pace compared to the Nissan. Um, you've then got Aid. He's in uh, McNeil's car. Again, it's a Nissan Silvia like mine. Team Dynamics. That's Aid. Um, Looks like Mint Detail is... He's in a Silvia too. But he's in the uh, Nissan Primera livery, the Vodafone one. Drove, drove that in the, back in the day. Who was that? Hey, hello. Okay. Uh, Carlos is in uh, Winklehawks BMW. That's a nice delivery on that one. Somebody's done a really good job on that car. It really does look nice. Um, 
Jackie is in the Alpha in the pits at the moment. Uh, Kuro is in the Audi, uh, but he's actually a uh, Subaru Impreza, but that's the old Audi livery from back in the day. Uh, Jack Kobe uh, we saw. I'm in the, uh, the Silver as well, Tim Harvey's livery. Uh, Malkovich is in the um, Genesis in the old rapid fit one i think that was um Radisic used to drive that but i think he's he's got a different name on the car looking at that i can't actually see who it is uh mint detail we looked at jonesy is in a bmw that's in the listerine car i don't know who drove that back in the day i don't even remember that car if i'm perfectly honest um That's interesting, it's got Jonesy's name on it. I wonder if mine's got my name on it, I'm not sure. Uh, then we're back to M1M. Carlos, Aid. Uh, oh, that's uh, Dan. Um, you're gonna be watching that car out the front, I would imagine. That is uh, another of the Genesis, a G70, I think. Uh, that's, um, oh, that's Radisic. So that must have been when he was with the uh, Valvoline. Uh, because he, he was with Ford at one point. When I worked at Ford, um, he used to run with us in the Mondeo. It was a rap I thought it was a rapid fit Mondeo, but it might not have been. Uh, in fact, I don't think it was actually. It was the um, it was the earlier livery, I think. Uh, Matt, Mikey, Dan, first time I've noticed. Do you, if you have a setup on the car and then tick in, it reverts back to the stock setup. I've been racing with stock setup all this time. Yeah, I've, I've found that. Um, and I'm actually leaving mine as stock because I, I set it all up and I was running Jack Kobe's setup and um, I've been practicing stock. So I'm, I'm leaving it as stock because I don't want to get into trouble. If I'm perfectly honest, I, yeah, I don't want to get into bother. All right, okay. So um, here we go. We are on the soft tyre. Right, going to go quiet now, guys. This is where it's all happening. We've got 10 minutes of quality. And then the... Um, but the sprint race afterwards, which is six laps, not 12, it will be a reverse grid. And my prediction is I'm going to be quite up the front of the grid for the um, sprint race. Let's just back out of this. We're not racing. This is an outlap. It's just uh, leaves some space because I understand that slipstreaming does not work in quality. There's absolutely no point being tucked up behind somebody. <sighs> so I have got a car behind. that corner I hate that corner it's the most important corner on the whole of the track
Come on, nerves, settle down, settle down. Way too deep and the wrong gear. Oh. need another good lap that was terrible too wide through there too No, my hands have been getting uh, too sweaty and uh, I'm trying without gloves tonight. Whether I'll put them on later on for the lobby racing or not, I'm not sure. Nine one dropping down the order. Look, and the sixth now. I remind you, there are some quick drivers in this. in the gravel that's probably a penalty I'm not sure I can go much quicker than that. 
What is this one? A 149.3. Ugh. Not even as quick as the one before. It's just glide. So that's mullered that one. Yeah. zero I'm gonna leave it a zero Just had a back out of that one, let Leroy through. He's uh, potentially on a hot lap. I don't want to scupper his lap when I'm only on an out lap. That would not be fair. Some people would call it team tactics, but I don't play that way. Right, hard tyres, rain in the brake, the brake points. I'm going to get out of the way of this Atenza as well. Don't know if he's on a hot lap, but um, I don't want to spoil their decent laps. I'm just going to come off. I'm not on competitive tyres and it's just not fair for me to get in the way of people. Where are we? We've got nobody else on track behind. So we might get another one in, possibly. Again, it won't be a hot lap because I'm on the wrong tyres. what I do want to do. Oh, caught that wall again. Oh, Shimmy, thank you for the six months, my friend. Uh, thank you for the good luck. Oh, Matt, Mikey, that's, that, was, that would have been a good idea, wouldn't it? Could have done a little qualifying strategy, just done two laps, then pit for fresh soft and have low fuel. Yeah, getting out on the green stuff, definitely, definitely gives you a penalty if you're not careful. I think you can put one wheel on, but if you get too much on, you're in trouble. Sint, thank you for the good luck. Um, okay, for the... The races, as I said, I'm going to be very, very, very quiet on chat. Hey, yeah, just a tad late. You needed to tell me that 10 minutes ago. <laughs> well, I'll, I'll bank that one for the future. Uh, it's something I've never really thought about, if I'm honest. Something I've never thought about. So we've got Jack Kobe in this one, uh, Dan Gleebles, Jack Daytona, Carlos Fandango, Kuro Sasori. Malkovich, myself, Nixter85 Gaming, Aid, M1M, Mint Detail, Leroy Jenkins, Jonesy, Jackie Boy, and it looks like that is your fifth, your 14 runners. So it looks like we're one light, we're actually two light, but I believe that um, Drac Fury is doing live comms on this one. So 
if you would like to listen to him doing a commentary head over to his youtube channel and um you can listen to him doing a live commentary and moving up and down the order of the vehicles rather than just watching me and if i don't expect drakkins listening to me um but it, he can throw up his um his 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 um his youtube address now i'm not listening to um the hosts at the moment because my phone is all but dead and i wanted to concentrate so they will be talking about a lot of stuff that i can't hear um, so i am a little bit deaf to what they're doing but hey ho it is what it is uh seventh is pretty good but i'm right in the middle of the pack i am i want to try and stay with the top six and or hold up the guys behind me i'm not going to be looking at the chat and i'm actually going to stop with the chat right now um uh, captain i've actually got the light off um i mean i can turn it on but then i've got the light right there and at the moment I, i'm actually quite liking the fact that i'm literally just focused on this screen um, at the moment so I know it's not great for you guys but I'm actually quite liking this this screen the way that it is right now um, as I said I can turn the light on if you guys need it or I need it but for the moment I'm quite happy with that light off for the minute oh. right just come on calm down oh, I'm, I'm sweating sweating like crazy uh, don't think Jack Kobe likes this, the car that he's got, uh, but he'll probably still blitz everything. Oh. Jack Kobe doesn't like the car, but look where he's qualified. Um, right up there. Right up there. Dan is very, very quick. Um, he absolutely monstered this race in the first round. He didn't run the second round. Uh, I managed to get two third places on a fastest lap which strangely has put me top of the table, but I know that that is not going to be something that I'm going to be able to talk about for a lot longer. Um, but there are some quick old boys ahead and behind. Um, Aid is only two cars behind me and he's quick. M1M is pretty quick and Mint Detail is pretty quick. Um, Leroy, I haven't run with too, too much. Uh, but, you know, they're all pretty, pretty quick people in here. Uh, Map Mikey, that's that's part of my strategy. Uh, I'm starting on the. Didn't give my strategy away if I talk too much, are I? Um, oh, I don't care. I'm starting on the hard tyres. I'm going to come in on a pre-given um, lap, assuming I don't mess it up like I did in the week. Put on the softs, and I'm going to hope. I'm going to hope to be in some fresh air and or around one or two cars that I can slipstream and just see if I can work my way up the order that way. Um, Drifty, good evening. Uh, Drifty doesn't have a subscription to play online or if you can afford it, get it because online racing with real world, real life people, not real world, real life people is an absolute game changer in Gran Turismo especially if you can get into respectful clean lobbies or respectful clean daily races but I tell you now respectful clean daily races is a contradiction in terms right I'm going quiet guys I am going quiet good luck everybody good luck right Shumi's trick for the launch. Oh, 
old tyres into the first corner. Oh, it popped down off the line. You're not going to win it in the first corner, Mitch. You'll just take it easy. Oh. Keep an eye on this radar too. Tires, tires, tires. That was a big moment. Hard tyres, hard tyres, hard tyres. Aid's going defensive. Love to know what tyres these guys are on. Oh, I might cut that one too much. Yeah, I thought I did. Ah, I don't want to be doing that. Just pushing it so hard on these hard tyres. Leave room for Malkovich on the outside there. It's going to compromise me for this corner. Not Malkovich, it was M1. Sorry, didn't even know who it was. Oh, 
Oh, what have I just done? What the heck happened there? I must have caught the wrong button on my steering wheel. Not done that before. That's not good. Right, we end a lap three. Whoa! Oh! Hard tyres, Mitchell. You got hard tyres on. Sorry for shouting, guys. cautiously into the pits. I've already hit the barrier twice this evening. Way too deep into there. Come on, come on, come on. Don't press the refuel button. Don't press the refuel button. Don't press the refuel button. Don't press it. Don't press it. Don't press it. Slightly over refueled, which is what I want to do. Part of the strategy. Right, loads of clean air. Jack's gone for my strategy. He's been running with me far too long this week. I wonder how many others are on the hards.
Trust me, Reese. I know what I'm doing. Although the seed of doubt is in now. I think I've got the wrong fuel map on now as well. Right, stop playing, just get on with racing. That's all fine, that's all fine. Right, back to concentrating. Loads of people on hard tyres. Oh, slide there. That's not going to help the tyres. Can't do that, can't do that.
Might be a penalty. Tell you what, Reese. These tyres are wearing more than they did when I was racing in the practice that I did. It's a penalty. Definitely gone too wide on that one. You could be right. Should have gone to lap five, I think. We're in fourth. Let's just look after these tyres a little bit and see if we can just keep fourth. Yeah, I've run and run and run this uh, this strategy. I was comfortable with it. It's definitely something a little bit different to this lobby and the ones that I've been running. Evening up. Everybody's now shouting at me. Don't look at the chat. Don't look at the chat. Got 20 seconds off of Jack Kobe. That is demoralizing. Let's look after this tyre. The nice thing about this rig is I can feel when it's scrubbing and just back off a little bit. Scrubbing it, scrubbing it, scrubbing it. Can feel it. Every corner now. Regardless of how easy I take it, I can feel it scrubbing. Five point nine. To Nixta behind. Carlos has gone. All we got to do is bring this home. And I'll be wickedly happy when this is finished. Oh, it's sliding, sliding, sliding. 
It's gone. I can feel that tyre's gone now. One lap too soon on the pit stop. Reese, my friends, you know your stuff. How far are we to next to behind? Why didn't I listen to my pit crew? Oh, what a slide! <laughs> Far behind is next uh, 5.8, so I think we're doing okay. Let's just bring this home now. Don't spin it. Keep it easy. You've got time on your hands. Listen to your pit crew. Take it easy. Last corner. Just all you've got to do is get through here. Don't go on the gravel. And we're going to bring that home for fourth. Get in there! Yes! Wow! Beating Jack, Dan and Carlos was just never, ever, ever, ever on the cards. Never in a month of Sundays. And uh, 22 seconds off the pace. But I'll take that. Oh, we'll take that. Yes! Woo-ha! <laughs> Woo! Where did I start? I can't even remember where I started now. Oh, I am shattered. But boy, those tyres were gone at the end. Absolutely gone. Three positions raised. It's a shame we don't get points for raised positions. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. And with the likes of Dan and Jackie in the room, there's no way you can even think about a fastest lap. Um, oh, man, I'm happy with that. I am happy with that. Yes. Yes. <sighs> happy, happy. Congratulations, Jack. Absolutely brilliant, my friend. Absolutely brilliant. Well done. Well done. To think that you only got that car a day or two ago you've been running for two weeks in the Sylvia to jump in that and bang a win in congratulations absolutely banging whoa There you go, 20 minutes practice he had in that car. So that is, in my mind, the sign of a really good racer that has been in a particular car for two weeks, grinding, grinding, grinding laps out for two weeks with us, to suddenly have to switch into a different car and nail it is brilliant. Well done. And I, I um, I don't mean that patronising, but any at all. It's not supposed to sound patronising. I am genuinely in awe of people that can do that. Um, I know people argue that BOP is on and it equals things, but different cars handle different ways. And um, yeah, absolutely wow, brilliant. Oh, man. Why is Ryan asking about any GR4? The, the cars are set. We're, we're all in. We're all in set cars. 
I'm a bit confused. Um, for those of you, we've got 27 people watching me at the moment. Thank you ever so much. Please smack the like button if you would be so kind. And um, if you want to hear a commentary of these races, Drac Fury on his channel is doing live commentary as the races are running. So if you would like to experience that or listen to Drac's uh, commentary, then please head over to his channel. Are you all right, Coda? Are you all right? What's up? Oh. <sighs> yeah, I'm just wondering what time the sprint's going to be. Because um, I could do with just shooting downstairs quickly. Hi, MC. How you doing, my friend? Oh, God, we've got to do all that again. I've I'm, I'm got to do it from the back of the grid this time. Oh, I wish. <laughs> uh, racing mediums is what we're looking for. Okay, so no no strategy in this one. Six laps. We've got to absolutely go for it. We are going to be late doing my own live stream, I'm afraid, guys. Um, because we're eight minutes away and best win in the world. Um, this race is going to take the best part of 10 to 15 minutes. So we will just be a few minutes late doing our BMW stream. But we, we will get into that. And I will need five minutes just to take Coda down the road as well. Um, uh, so 10.55 start. We've got three minutes. I should be out on track. But I just, I need, uh, I need to settle. I'm so nervous. I just need to settle for the moment. Oh. It looks like we got, uh, everybody stayed on for this one. Nobody's dropped out. The grid should be reversed, um, so it's all a bit, all a little bit mixed up at the moment. Uh, Game of Dan, it's the BMW M3 Sport Evolution 89, I think. Uh, I would show you, but I can't come out of here at the moment. Um, if you look at the um, the uh, thumbnail for the video it's it's the car that's in the thumbnail for the video um, it could get a bit bumpy tonight but it's a, it's a wicked car and I think we're going to be running that on sports tires as well um, uh, Synth is asking can I get a, some of Jack's ethanol I, I don't need the ethanol it's the skill I need his brain I need his young brain in my old head uh, and that might <laughs> that might help. <laughs> um, I'm too old for this lark, but I'm probably enjoying it. Um, hey, all the latest join the room. I'm assuming Orb's going to be watching. Right, we're just under a minute to go. Um, this one, Kuro, um, advertised, promoted, mentioned it on uh, our Discord, and uh, I found it through that way. Uh, but how you actually find a lot of these championships, I, I really don't know. Um, for me, it's all through uh, friends and friends of friends uh, in Gran Turismo. Uh, good evening, Bogs. Uh, that tends to be how I find how I find out about them. Um, oh, we've lost somebody. We've lost somebody. Um, good evening, Vagger. If I didn't say good evening, I um, forgive me if anybody I is in the chat that I haven't said hello to. 
Um, it's purely because I am solely concentrating on the races. I need to get in the zone. We're going to go live in a moment, guys. I'm going quiet. I'll see you on the other side. Uh, I'm going to be starting right at the back of the grid for this one. So I don't quite know how this one is going to pan out. Um, as you can see there, we've got uh, Jack Kobe, Dan and Carlos behind three stonkingly quick guys um, who are going to overtake me. The big question is where and when. Is it going to be a... I'm not going to use the word lunge because those guys are too good for that word. But is it going to be into the first corner? Um, are they going to hang back and just overtake through the course of the first lap? Do they know where I'm slow? Do they know where I'm weak and vulnerable? So many unknowns. So many unknowns. Jack Kobe, good luck, my friend, to you also. Uh, good luck. Think about your exits. I will do. Good luck. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Let's get in the zone. Right, Shumi's trick for the start. <sighs> Sorry, I'm, I'm using Shumi's name because Shumi gave me a trick for the start and that's what gets in my head. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Oh my God, did I jump the start? That was awfully close. As I knew, the guys behind super quick. Brilliant fast reactions from somebody who's coming around the side of me. Right, we can't all win it into the first corner, guys. Not got anybody going off in this one. This is um, a lot cleaner than Brands from memory. Oh, I just got into the back of eight there. That's uh, caused me some issues. Oh, Mint and uh, Jack are having a bit of a a bit of a battle there. Let's try not to get mixed up in that. Oh, all sorts of bashing and crashing into that one. Let's just try and stay out of trouble. Might have cut that aid. Went deep. I had to get up the inside, and that uh, was awfully close to a corner cut.
Sorry, Malk. Not sure if we touched. That was awfully close. Oh, and again. It's just catching me out into the corners a little bit at the moment. I hope that was clean. I hope that was clean. I really do. Please let me know in the chat if you felt that was clean or not. Just for my own peace of mind. I can't get the place back, but I'm hoping it was clean. Oh, it's too deep, too deep, too deep. Everybody's quiet in the chat. <laughs> right, it's going with us. See, where is he? Where is he? He's still there. Oh, 
Oh no! No! the penalty so I'm not going to fight him it's not worth it well done Jackie Well done, Jackie. Oh, good race. He got the better of me that time. <laughs> I got the better of him twice last time. He got the better of me this time. But fourth, I'll settle for that. I am shaking like a leaf. Wow, there we go, Jack Kobe winning that one with a 148.4, Dan in second with a 149.1, Jackie got the better of me this time, I got that half second penalty and it just took the edge off it for me a little bit and I decided then to settle for fourth, uh, it was always going to go by me uh, and I just wanted to bring it home, uh, 159, I could see that uh, it was not going to be worth the point. Oh, I did manage to get fourth. Uh, Malkovic in fifth, Carlos in sixth, Mint Detail in seventh, Aid in eighth, Jackie Boy in ninth, Nixter 85 Gaming in tenth, Leroy 11th, M1M 12th, and Jonesy in 13th. Wow. Ooh, am I worn out? <laughs> ah, what a result that is. Um, I won't be leading, <laughs> I don't think, tonight. Uh, but what was that? was that? Is that two fours I think I got this evening? I can't remember. I, I, I can't even remember anything about the first race. Um, but um, well done to uh, to the three guys up the front. Absolutely fantastic. Um, 
I am going to, um, I need to take code down the road just for five minutes and then um, Jack Kobe, well done Mitch, was trying to watch some of it while driving on the straights. Why aren't you rub my nose in it more and more and more? Not only are you blitzing the race, <laughs> you're also doing a Max Verstappen and a Lewis Hamilton and looking at the blooming screens as you're going around. Oh my god. Oh my word. Um Aid, unfortunately I, I didn't save either of the um either of the replays. Um I I didn't do either. Um oh I am whacked. Um, Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I am pooped. I am shattered. Wow. That's just blinded me. That has absolutely just blinded me. Um, I'll tell you what, Coda is fast asleep just over the other side of the room. Um, so I think that I might just get straight into this. Because uh, I, I can run up to about 11 o'clock and then I, I, uh, I'm hoping to give it a uh, knock it on the head about 11. Um, so just for you guys, um, we're racing for real 16 people all start off, started a branch hatch. And then after that, I'm going to go wherever you guys want to go. Uh, six laps. Most of these are going to be, uh, custom weather. So it's going to be random weather uh, the variable time speed rate. I've got as one and we've just got afternoon running. Uh, we can change these up as you want. I'm going to rolling start slowest first for all of these to try and get over the shenanigans we had on Wednesday. I think it was Wednesday. Um, I'm hoping we're not going to get a repeat of that. Um, more on that later. Uh, BOP is on. I have got um, loads of stuff that you can do to the car if you really want to. Boost is off. Slipstream is real. Mechanical damage is light. Tie wear one on one. So just sprint races tonight unless we want to change that. Uh, initial fuel is default. Uh, I've got 90 seconds for the race finish delay. We might have to increase that for the Nords at the end and any longer races we want to do. But I think we may well just keep it sweet, short and sweet. Um, I've got the PP limit, minimum weight and max power set. So we should have um, standard race cars. Um, although, although I think that people are going to want to go sports tyres, which means that those limits there are probably going to be too high and potentially may well need to be changed. So I'm just going to create that room. I'll have a look at my car and I may well need to adjust for the tire. I mean, it only be the PP that will be different on the tires. So I think we'll probably be OK. And I believe that my car is stock. Um, and um, oh, crikey. Uh, I think that those I think that I have got the settings too tight. I think I'm going to need to adjust those already. Um, 466. What did I set it to? Oh, no, 467. Um, what tyres have I got on this thing? I think I'm going to need to change it. Uh, yeah, 498. 
Um, so I'm going to need to change that the PP to 500. And uh, hopefully the others are the same. Ah, uh, got some people are coming in, but they're going to struggle because they won't be able to get the cars. Now's where we find out who's listening on the chat and who isn't. Yeah. Welsh boy, I, um, I have got no clue why the lobby wouldn't be showing up for you. I had to get something wrong, didn't I? You know me, you know what I'm like. Might have been because I was trying to change some bits and pieces. Let's just make sure we can get in. It needs to be 500 or less. Well, I'm, my PP is 498. What? Oh, here we go with this stupid shenanigans of the game. It's got to be a bug in here somewhere. Let me take it up to 410. Oh. Game it down, 508. How on earth are you 508? Your car can, cannot be stock. Ninja, it can't be. Gamer, Dan, it can't be. You're in violation of the settings and not be able to enter this race. Please change the following 500 or less. I am. I'm sitting on 498. What is... Um... It does not make sense. That does not make sense. Sorry, guys. Now it lets me in. Um, my car, as you will see, um, I've got suspension is just set as it normally is, a differential set as it normally is. Uh, the downforce is zero zero. The ECU is not changeable. Neither is the performance adjust. Neither is the transmission. That's just normal. Nitrous is nothing. Normal, normal, normal on absolutely everything. Normal on everything. And I am normal on everything else. The only thing I can think of is possibly liveries if you guys have got kits or something on maybe that might be pushing you over a little bit um but i am completely stock and i'm at 498.62 so not quite sure what's going on but there we go uh so this evening um I haven't really got a plan for tracks. We can just do whatever tracks we want. I'm thinking some of the tracks that we know and some of the smaller ones. Usual rules apply. If you do bump somebody off, please give the place back. Apologize after the race. Some people have been saying, I can't apologize during a race because you go into auto drive and then that slows the car down. I don't want you to be texting while you're driving during the race. So apologize in the chats and just explain what happened after the race um during the race we want to be racing and not getting in each other's way um so it's again i would say if you do bump somebody and wreck their race give the place back um it means that the two of you can then just race each other because we do not want people rage quitting we had an issue last week 
and I'm not naming names, where there was an incident, somebody got bumped off. That person that did the bump went two or three corners to pull over where they could safely, which is the right thing to do. But unfortunately, the other party raged quit and then that ruined the race for both parties. From Monday, if people rage quit, we're going to start kicking people out of the lobby for that evening. Um, because we've got so many people that want to race, I want people finishing races. Uh, likewise, if people drop into the room and then they don't pick a car in a timely manner, we will kick them so that we can get somebody in who does want to race. That's all going to be kicking off on Monday. And I want to just do a little bit on the um, on the Discord and on the chat information um, about that before we do anything. Uh, Game it down. As he says, giving the place back is a form of apology in the race. You give the place back, it's, I'm sorry, I hit you. I've messed up your race. I didn't mean it, it was an accident. And therefore people should draw a line under it. Um, because one of the things I am not gonna put up with is um, the chat that we had last week for two reasons. One, I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm sensitive and it upsets me. Um, it really upsets me. And there were a number of people that contacted me to say that they were very uncomfortable. I will use that word. Some of them put it a lot stronger than that. It, some people were very uncomfortable with the tone of the chat last week, over several days. It's not just one isolated incident. I don't know what happened last week. Uh, words have been had with lots of different people, lots of discussion both public and private on Discord. And I'm hoping that we can put all of that behind us and move on. Uh, we all know the rules and we all know what we want to do. Obviously, um, as Shumi said, bumping is fine as long as you don't gain an advantage. I mean, I, for those of you that were watching the race just a minute ago, I think it was Malkovich that I was running behind. Malko assuming it was Malkovich, and if it wasn't, I apologise. But he broke a little bit early. I broke a little bit late. I think there was a slight bump and I, I pushed him just into the corner a little bit more than he would have liked. But I backed out mid corner. I made sure that I followed him out the corner. I didn't gain an advantage. Um, in fact, I lost out because the car behind me overtook. Um, in my mind, that, that sort of thing's OK. But if, if you if you bump somebody off the road and you've ruined their race, you know, please just give the place back. Um, and, you know, if somebody does clobber you, don't go into the next corner and just, you know, run them off the road and lose your temper like a lot of us do. And I'm including me in this um, because it just it doesn't help anybody and it doesn't help everybody to get back on the same page and racing nicely. And, of course, we've got so many different levels of skills in here. Right. I'm going to get the qualifier underway at 21. I'm going to go 21 um 21 30 on this because i want a few minutes on track and i'm also giving people a little bit of time to get their cars sorted out to get to grips with their tires and hopefully when we go into the first corner it won't be carnage and as ashley said slow down off the racing line yeah a lot of people when you have a bump and i am guilty of this Whoa! i'm guilty of this i immediately think oh crikey I've just hit somebody. I need to get the place back. Back out, back out. And I don't realise I've got about three other guys coming up hot behind me. I've backed out on the racing line and then I'm causing more problems behind me. So if you do hit somebody, by all means, if you hit somebody in that corner, carry on, carry on. I mean, you could come over here and back out as I'm doing to let that car by. Or if you bump somebody here, well, get through this corner Don't back out here because you've got a nice long straight coming up. Back out here, off the racing line. Let them by, come across, job done. And I'll tell you now, with these cars, there is going to be bumping tonight. I can promise you that. Especially when we got on some of the tight and twisty 
twisty track tracks oh i can't get my words out uh, i'm still buzzing after those two races earlier i will leave you to read the uh, chat for more information about everything that's going on and uh, for those of you that are not on discord we now have a group of guys that i have handpicked for different reasons um there's seven of us i think now who are stewards and my take is if there is a what i refer to as a political policy decision or a political decision in other words a a contentious or a difficult decision that needs to be made we will make it as stewards collectively and what i'm looking for because i don't want to take too much of the time of the stewards is i'll be looking for three people to give me their thoughts and then i will make a decision following that and that's how we're going to be doing things from now on and i'm probably going to be covering this off quite a bit over the next week of races ninja who, who picked the tires um well everybody wants sports tires when we are in a car like this so that's why we're in these i would prefer to be in racing tires actually but this is the reason why we're in these ones and if you say you want your comfort tires oh no way i cannot drive on comfort tires whoa Uh, Ninja, as far as I'm aware, we're doing a long, um, a long practice session for the moment. So hopefully, Jonesy will be back in. I've got a couple of minutes before we go running. One of the things that people have asked uh, is that we do a 10-minute practice followed by a five-minute quali. There was a talk about me bringing back the 10-minute qualifier. The majority decision seemed to be against that because on some of the races, um, the qualifying is almost as long as the race. So we're sticking with five minute qualifiers, but we've got 10 minutes of practice, which should give people plenty of time to feel their way around the track, think about how they're gonna race, think about how they're gonna approach things. And uh, hopefully the racing will get back to being tight and clean. Oh, there was a lot of information in that one, wasn't there? Oh, so much information. And please note, I did not mention any names and all of that because none of it, none of what I do, I want to make personal. It is all for the good of the community that we are building and for the good of the racing. Whoa. We're all here to learn, as far as I'm concerned. Whoa! On the grass. Ugh. And I tell you now, guys, you're going to have to watch me tonight because I am going to be Mr. Ram. I should be wearing horns. I'm bleating. I could be giving some serious places back. Um, the other thing as well, guys, tonight is you're going to see me um, dropping back. I want to race with uh, some of our newer members and some of the guys that are normally running towards the back. I want to run with some of them. So you've seen how I can race this evening. Tonight, I'm all about fun. And enjoying this wonderful 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 car i really wanted one of these back in the day obviously could never afford one and i just want to enjoy it i might actually go on this view as well 
Don't trouble with this one. I've got to keep looking behind. I've got Carlos behind me. Yeah, dropping back. Ha ha. Yeah, I'm probably going to be last anyway, so there won't be any dropping back at all, will there? <laughs> yeah, Mad Mikey, you put me on a place. Good and proper. And I like that. <laughs> me getting all up myself, look. Mr. Mitchell blowing his own trumpet. Whoa, sin. Sorry, Jonesy. There ain't a lot you can do when somebody's parked up across the middle of the track. Jonesy, I apologise. Uh, at least I now know that Jonesy's in. Uh, in, in the right in here right okay we've got 14 and 16 we've got two places left but we have got jack kobe rl9010 game of dan welsh boy uh kian i did get that right uh jenky carlos myself jonesy junior speedy synth thugs gt tom um map mikey to be honest though you had a great race in the tc stcc i think surprised even yourself mate i did i did i did um i was to be quite honest and i mean this sincerely i was hoping to get mid-pack i was really hoping to get mid-pack um to get just off the podium was great i'm a bit disappointed with myself in the last race i got the half second penalty i feel as if i could have got a podium um but i love the scrap with jackie daytona loved that scrap um he's such a respectful racer um i'm gonna be honest there's not a lot of people that i know i can really go full pelt side by side um for those of you that are around here and like to do that sort of stuff uh jack kobe shumi and um jackie Daytona are the three guys that I know I have absolutely gone side by side with and I'm talking about all helped side by side with uh, there are others that I will happily go side by side with that are a little bit slower but I'm, I'm talking about people that are at the point where the car's practically out of control um, but yeah I don't normally name names but I have got an enormous amount of respect for those three as do i have a lot of respect for a number of you but those are just three guys that i have gone side by side with several times and I don't tend to go side by side with many people i'm not that good maybe we can change that tonight and i can add a few more names to that to that list How's about that? Who wants to go side by side with me tonight? Code is still asleep at the moment, so that's all good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my god, Fargo. There you go. That's my sentence of the night so far. Right there. Let's have some cuddles on track. Incidentally, uh, the cat's away. The mouse is playing. So tomorrow, I've got a few chores to do. But um, I am intending, for those of you that are interested in such things is um i'm intending to try and do some lobby races um i did two in the week uh, the night where i stopped the stream early um and i've said about that and i got punted into the first corner quite badly and spun round but i finished that race two places higher than i started in the second race there was a load of a and a plus rated drivers in i think there was only four or five of us b-rated racers from memory and i finished four places higher in that one so really really pleased and uh whether that's going to be the same tomorrow i don't know
could well be a lot of kids on tomorrow whereas when I was racing it was uh, like two three o'clock in the morning and um, it was basically a, a number of Americans and one or two Europeans in there from memory but as I said tonight for me it's just more about chilling end of a long week and just having fun with my mates online racing around in this stunningly brilliant wonderful little car whoa incidentally um, thank you to everybody that had my back during those um, races earlier on um, reminding me to change oil and um, things like that uh, Mad Mike is saying I should get a USA account Kushti's told me that on a couple of occasions um, a lot of people will have two accounts um, yeah too many people are telling me that now maybe that is something I should do but you know what I I enjoy just running this account and putting my life up on YouTube racing this I mean yeah there's some stuff I do offline I'll be honest but a lot of it is just going online so um, and I'm, I'm quite happy to just do that with the uh, with the one account uh, and the other thing as well is come July I'm looking to try and change my schedule to do lobby racing in the evening and a little bit of daily races during the day so obviously those daily races will be done on the European servers um, yeah Mad Mikey you couldn't go through all the progress of leveling up again though the thing is I'm told that you can level up quite quickly to get into the dailies and you don't need to do all the licenses and the menu books and everything else uh, and you only need a few cars and of course you can rent the cars although you can't have your liveries on so I'm sort of tempted it will probably happen at some point but for the moment I'm not that fussed uh, if I'm honest I think when Kushti did it I think he levelled up to the point where he could um, race in the dailies literally within a couple of hours I don't think it was very long at all I might be lying it might be longer than that but I think it was it was only a few licenses Jack Kobe, does doing the licenses increase your DR? No, I don't think it does. I don't think it makes any difference whatsoever. Um, I really don't. I think you've got to do certain licenses to be able to get into um, into the into the, the daily races. But um, uh, so Ninda says, me and Jonesy have the best liveries. By the way, um, that's a bold statement. Yeah, but you, you, that's the Demon Tweaks one. That's okay. Um, I actually like Thugs's. I think that the Thugs's, was that Dulux? I like Thugs's one. We will have a look at some of the liveries. Um, and we might even, because we've got a few, we might even have somebody uh, who's not racing with us in the chat, hands up somebody, um, choose who's got the best livery. Um because I know some of these are robbed off of the um, off the editor, as is mine. Mine is not my own. But I believe that Speedy B is his own. Alan Jenkins is his own. And Jenkins is a brilliant little livery. Um, right, let's, um, let's get this one underway. And uh, we'll see how we go. Good luck, everybody. Please, please remember the rules. And let's not have a repeat of earlier in the week. Here we go. Good luck, good luck, good luck. Baz, are you not racing? Baz, if you're not racing and he's not, Baz, do you want to do the winner of the 
livery. Okay. Baz, my friend, you've got the ultimate responsibility of picking the best livery of the night. Bearing in mind there may well be a few more cars to come. that out on the gravel that's letting everybody through incidentally I will be commentating on one or two tonight most likely when you guys pick a track I don't like <laughs> oh I'm going around already here we go oh sorry whoever I hit that was completely out of control and across the track and I couldn't stop it It started already. I wonder whether I should stay on this view for the moment. The problem is for the STCCs, I've been using this view, but actually I prefer the other view that I was just on. But the problem is I'm getting used to this one and my eyes are picking up changes to the um, to the attitude of the car more in this view than the other one which is really really annoying because I don't particularly like this view if I'm honest I really wish they'd put the mirror in the other view I like to glance up at the mirror rather than having to look at the radar or the delta times. Yeah. What Matt Mikey said. <laughs> It is so hard, do you know what, it is so hard to run a stream, look at the chat, whoa, I didn't even see Jonesy coming through there, sorry mate, um, it's so hard to run a stream and look at the chat, make sure that everybody's doing what they should be doing, making sure that it's all respectful and race. Several people have said, oh my gosh, you're terrible at racing when you're uh, streaming. What is up with you? And then they try it and they're like, they contact me afterwards and go, oh my word, I'm sorry for saying what I said. I didn't realise how hard it is. Dan, thank you for the, uh, it says, hey Mitchell, great racing to P4s. Thank you very much, my friend. I think that was probably a, well, I was going to say it was as good as I could expect, although I was a bit annoyed with myself in the last race. I uh, got a penalty and I let Jackie Daytona uh, take third. Uh, I should have had third place, but on the night, the better person won. And uh, as I said in the, the little chatty thing, congratulations to Jackie. We had three superb battles now. Um, two massive battles in round one and two where I think I managed to come off best in both of those two and uh, he was not having any of it tonight and um, whoa, I've gone round again while I'm talking see I can't talk and race can I um, I can't even what I'm saying now yeah he's, he got the better of me tonight the better man won and um, my heartfelt congratulations go to uh, to him for that podium. Well earned in my book. It's very, very, very slidey, this car. Reese is just saying only women can multitask. 
Well, arguably, I'm multitasking now. I'm, I'm working pedals, I'm breathing, I'm looking, I'm trying to race, I'm trying to turn the steering wheel. Um, I'm trying to think what I'm saying and failing because I got no clue where that was going. <laughs> oh, come on! Now the STCC is is fun. It's um, it is showing you guys how I can race when I apply myself, if I'm honest. And uh, one of the things I want to say again, and I probably will say again later on, is thank you to everybody that has raced and helped me over the last couple of weeks to get to Grits of Barcelona. Uh, massive shout out to Jack Kobe, who um, sorted me out with um, some a setup and also for giving me the opportunity to review his uh, replays and uh, as well as a number of other people that we were racing with that I was able to look at replays for um, really made a massive difference as I hope you've seen and hope in some small way um, I gave you a little bit of payback with those results If you'd seen how I was racing that track two weeks ago, oh, it was woeful. There was one night that I had a load of you were helping me, and I'm not naming names because I can't remember who was actually on that stream because I was concentrating so much. Uh, but I took four seconds off my lap time in about half an hour or so. It was just amazing. And I apologise, I'm running around on my own here. I've uh, got Jonesy's about 11 seconds down the road. Hi Terry, how many of our entrants use a wheel or hand controller? Um, difficult question. Obviously, we can put a poll out on that one. Um, or people can ans answer you in the chat. But we have, I believe, probably... A two-third mix of people working or driving on the controller or pad whatever you want to call it uh, so one third on that one third on standard wheels like the Thrustmaster and the Logitech G29 and probably a third on direct drive like the one I'm on um, I am on a Logitech DD Pro wheel and that is mounted into a GT Omega Prime rig and this whole thing is rock solid. Good evening, I'm faced. How are you, my friend? Good evening to everybody that I haven't said hello to, by the way. Um, it's been one of those evenings where I've really been concentrating for the early part of the evening, and obviously, I was not, I uh, didn't have the opportunity to um, keep up with the chat. It was super serious racing. Now, I'm just out to enjoy myself so I can interact with the chat a bit more. Let's go around. Key in behind me, I nearly took him out. Oh look, you get it all wrong, you lose the place, and then you get a penalty into the bargain. Why? Why do you do that game? Why do you do that? Why is why is Keen slowing down? Incidentally, uh, next week, 
we are doing the uh, Subaru and Mitsubishi 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 head-to-head -head, uh, which I'm really looking forward to and then I was Kian is just playing with me right now <laughs> that is the spirit of a Friday is just enjoying ourselves and playing Um, yeah, I, um, earlier on uh, to this afternoon I did a couple of races with a French gentleman or lady, don't know which, and um, that was a bit stereotypical and I apologise for that faux pas. Um, so yeah, a French individual and um, I'm going to take Ian in out in a minute. And we were in the, the, the BMW VGT, which is probably my favorite car in the whole of the game and I know that that causes some of our um, VR people some issues but I'm really keen to do an evening in the BMW VGT very keen to do it to the point where I might just do it and I'm just gonna have to apologize to the uh, to the VR guys or somebody opens up a lobby on that same night for anybody running the VR. Well, that was a bit of fun. That looked fun up the front. Uh, Jack Kobe saying, you'll have to watch that replay with Jenky and I. Unreal. I tell you what, Jack, Jenky is again, and that, he's a, a guy that I didn't mention. Jenky is a guy that you can race with. You can go side by side. He is respectful too. We've had some wicked, wicked um, battles on, on track. Um, Jenky and I. I love it when I go racing with Jenky. Unfortunately, he normally beats me. <laughs> uh, as he did you. As he did you. Oh, Jenky, yes, my friend. What a win. Love it. Well done with a 143.0. Uh, Jack Kobe, well done in second with a 140.4 and a fastest lap. RL90.10 in third with a 142.6. Game of Down in fourth. Thugs in fifth. Junior sixth. Carlos Fandango seventh. GT Tom in eighth. Welsh Boy ninth. Speedy B in tenth. Jonesy eleventh. Mitchell Morgan is back to his hopeless usual self in twelfth. And I've got terrible um, hiccups at the moment. Or indigestion um Ian in 13th and synth in a 14th uh so your top three Jenky, jack and rl 9010 and i am being told i am being told that we should watch the replay for all the right reasons and we'll do that at the end of the stream if you guys remind me because if i try and do it now i've got to come out the lobby and i don't really want to do that um right um quick question who would like to throw out a track or i'll pick one i really don't mind uh m1m just popped in to say congratulations thank you thank you thank you and as matt malkins just said congratulations to everybody in the stcc it was great racing um really brilliant loved every minute of it and i tell you Thank you to um, Jackie Daytona and Playwright for putting on an absolutely brilliant, brilliant championship. It's really well organised um, and it's just it's just a joy to run with those guys. It's really, really good. Uh, in Brands Hatch, we had quite a few people were thrown off the track tonight. Boy, people were ready for it. And I had noticed that quite a few people, uh, I recognise the names, have been running with us over the last couple of weeks. So hopefully this channel and the way that we race guys has helped to make tonight's race as good as it was um i loved it i thoroughly enjoyed it um okay i am not seeing anybody using that playstation racer uh which makes things jump out um but i've got um gamer dan is saying dragon's trail uh fargo saying st Croix b for the practice um i've got goodwoods being thrown out there so what i'm gonna do 
is, if I can find a piece of paper, is we have got, and I'm going to try and take these in order, Goodwood, uh, Dragon Trail, um, and I think that there was Sanqua B. Oh, God, Sanqua B is going to be a bit of a nightmare, isn't it? I mean, goodness me, I... I don't think I've well I have run the track because obviously I've done the um the world circuit races but I certainly do not remember it I certainly don't remember it um oh Suzuka do we not feel Suzuka might be a bit long I'm happy to give it a whirl I like Suzuka uh we got Daytona Trioval another firm favorite at night and we've got Suzuka. And then we've got the Nords. And i tell you what, I think that's probably going to see us through the night. Because that's what, one, two, three, four, five. That's six races. So, um, I think, I think that we will we'll be good. Oh, what can his Glenn short? Oh! Oh, oh, oh. That's a good shout, isn't it? Watkins Glen, yeah. Oh, my my phone is about to die. Um, that is going to be really annoying if we get anybody that wants to be friends, because um, I am going to be struggling with my phone a little bit. And the girls have pinched my charger, which is a bit of annoying. John, Nürburgring in the rain. Are you having a laugh? Are you having a laugh? <laughs> oh, but you know what? I'm actually up for that. I am actually up for that. <coughs> if we want to do Nords in the rain, um, that could be quite fun, couldn't it? In these. Oh, I've got other, I've got other chargers kicking around. It's just, um, it was just down by down here, um, by the rig for when I'm racing, um. But, yeah, one of the girls has pinched it. We've got so many chargers, yet yeah, they're always pinching my charger. I think we've got at least one in each car. Um, yeah, we got loads. we got loads. But uh, I just don't want to disappear for five or ten minutes trying to find it. We're not going to get many people want to, uh, want to do it here. Um... Incidentally, guys, if you do want to shoot out and get yourself a livery, uh, as Jonesy did uh, a moment ago, just let me know you're popping out to get a livery and um, we'll wait for you. The only trouble is maybe don't do that because I've just noticed we're up to 16 people now. Um, so, no, maybe maybe don't do that. That's probably not a very good idea. Um And Faz, I think, is um, going to be picking up the the best livery. It's got to be the Auto Trader one, hasn't it? Okay, here we go. Let's get the qualifying underway. And I am pretty much sticking to the timings tonight. If people aren't ready, it's sort of a little bit tough. Hope that chat is remaining um, respectful. Oi, oi! Hello, BMW. Uh, so Faz has got his first and his second. He just needs to pick his third. Ooh. 
Whoa, I'm looking at the chat and not where I'm going. Matt, we, we, we'll be running for a while, mate. Um, Joe and Lauren are both... <laughs> Jack, I just followed you off. Whoa, I'm going to take somebody else from me. Oh, my word. <laughs> oh, this is... this. this. Sorry, I've just, they've just spawned me in the middle of the track, right in front of a load of cars. How rubbish is that? It spawned, it unghosted, right as somebody was on me. Ah. Uh. Um, can't remember what I was saying. I can't remember. Yeah, oh yeah, Joe and Lauren are both out. Uh, today they're in uh, my youngest Hindu in Barcelona so uh, while the cat's away the mouse is going to play so um, whilst I can't be too 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 late because uh, I've got stuff to do tomorrow um, we could go through a few extra races tonight it looks like I might have cut somebody off for which I apologize but part of the new regime is that we are not going to wait a few people have said that i'm waiting around too long for people to sort cars out buy cars etc uh mtex so sorry if i cut you off mate um but what we're doing now is we're going to try 10 minutes of practice and i don't know if that was a full 10 minutes um uh, but yeah we do a, a, a little bit of a practice session then straight into the quality then into the race and if I cut anybody off then it's a sorry uh, Jenky don't worry about that if you're coming you know if you just had a pop out and you're just missing one race and then you're coming straight back in again um, I don't mind too much as long as we ain't got people doing it all the time it's fine Ashley um, have you got anything similar my friend um, unfortunately when I announced this one on our discord uh, the car was available and that's why a lot of people went out and bought it and I try and announce these things a little bit ahead of time where the car is needed to be bought uh, but i appreciate you're relatively new to us and that you will have missed that announcement but if you can find something that will fit the um the pp and stuff like that and maybe the age then uh, go with that i don't know what's in the uh the used car dealership what's in the used car dealership at the moment mate Clack, good evening. When are you going to come racing, my friend? Thank you for popping in, though. Incidentally, guys, if you haven't already, please smack the like button. It will really help me out massively as I take another trip across the grass. I tell you what, Goodwood is going to... They're, they're, they're going to be able to uh, stack their grass keeper because um, I'm going to be cutting so much grass for them. Um, go with the Cozy. It might be quick, but we did actually use the Cozy and these the other day. If you've got it, again, it's another one that you might not have. If you've got the Cozy, go with it. I know I can cancel the quali and restart it, but the problem is a lot of people have commented um, recently that they just want to keep it moving. Ashley, bring the cosy online, mate. Um, and if it comes to it, uh, if you're off the pace, whatever, 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 I'll join you. Um, I know this is going to upset a few people this new thing of 
me just starting it when I say I'm going to start it. I know it's going to upset a few people and I apologise for that. But it is the new way that we're going to be working. You'll soon all get used to it. The other thing that we're going to be doing from now on is um, at the end of the session, I'm going to be running the randomizer and writing all of that down and then publishing it for the following day. I'm not going to do that tonight, but over the weekend at some point, I'm going to run the randomizer and then we will publish all of the cars and the races that we will be doing on Monday. On Monday, we'll do the same for Tuesday. On Tuesday, we'll do the same for Wednesday, etc., etc., etc. And that way, you guys will know what cars are needed. If you haven't got a car that is exactly the same, I am more than happy for you to have something that is as close as you can make it. We've got 16 people in the moment. We've got Syntho, Labo, um, GT Tom, Junior, myself, Kyan, Kyan, Kian. Oh, mate, I'm sorry. I can't, I've, keep getting. It's Kian. Um, Carlos, Thugs, RL9010. That's so embarrassing. Jonesy, Welsh Boy, Gamer Dan, Jack Kobe, Shumi, Jenki, Mtech, and Speedy have all not got cars. So it looks like we've only got 12 of us in this one. Um, let's get this underway and then we'll get all of those other guys in for the rest. Um, oh, you know, you're asking me in Discord. It's going to be under the um, uh, it'd be under the PSR Lobby Racing channel. And then Friday night will be underneath the special events one. And they're also listed at events. And by the way, we've also got a few other people that are adding events to the Discord that they're running. Malkovich is promoting a an event that he is arranging that's going to be running from next month. And I think that Drac has arranged a couple of game nights for us as well. So we have already got other members in the community that are adding events into the Discord. Which I love. And thank you guys for doing that. As I said a million times, that Discord, it might have my name all over it. But it's not mine, it's ours. Oh, I've got a car coming up the inside. See, what I'm trying to work on is my spatial awareness at the moment. Whoa, nearly getting into the back of GT, Tom. Oh, got a lease room on the inside. Just checking the old uh, radar there. Synth getting a bit loose on the way through there. Oh, I need to leave some room on the I nearly ran him off. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm going to let him through. I'm sorry. I didn't see him there. Come on, Mitchell, you've got to check that radar more. God, this is going to be a bit hairy into here. Whoa! <laughs> bang, bang. God, did you hear that little lot going through my car? Oh, my word. Come on, get on the track. Come on, get and chase after them. Mitchell Morgan, at his best, causing complete and utter chaos. I am Games. Good evening. How are you? Incidentally, hello to anybody that I haven't said hello and I haven't mentioned. Um, it's been crazy in the chat today. It's going through really, really quickly. And um, everything was a bit serious earlier on. Now, oh, I think Synth and GT just had an incident. Thank you, guys. Little flash of headlights for the thank you. Thank you, thank you for being respectful. I can see one weighted. Now you see they're racing together. So one got bumped, I think, but now they're both racing together. This is what we do best. Uh, 
I know I'm in the thick of it. <laughs> Whoa, I've just covered GT Tom. Well, I'm going to wait for GT and um, think to catch up. It gets. Actually, I think we've lost since. Come on, GT, let's just go. Um, it gets a bit difficult when people are enjoying the cars and showboating and just getting the back end out of it because obviously that's a slow way through the corner and if you are racing sometimes it's difficult to actually um, miss them and as I think it was all Belator said um, how do you know whether you're having fun or racing serious and that's a very 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 good a very good point than the one I've been thinking about um, and I'm thinking that what we should do and this is different to what I said in the discord and I'll be interested to see what a lot of you think um, I'm just side by side with RL at the moment uh, my thinking is that during the week Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday we keep it serious, even if we're in cars like this, it's serious racing. Friday night cannot be serious. And the reason why I'm saying that is because we're in all sorts of different, you know, strange cars on strange tracks doing strange things. And I have been reliably informed, and I've seen several times where people said, I can't see to drive because it's the end of the week. People are chilling, people are having a one or two drinks and other things uh, to relax and um, it does get a little bit uh, untidy at times and so Friday night I think is fun night uh, so long as you haven't got somebody that's going around and just blatantly hammering everybody off the track anything goes we just have fun the rest of the week we race serious I don't know how you guys feel about that let me know what you think in the chat And then I'll crash while I'm trying to look at it. <laughs> Whoa! GT's got a massive crash at the back. I think he saved that. I want to catch up with RL 9010. RL's a really good racer. I want to go side by side. If I can. Can I catch him? That's the question. Not if I go for a corner like that, I won't. I do love this car. Oh, Arel's, what's Arel going? He's going down the street and running it off the track. What's all that about? Incidentally, did anybody head off and listen to uh, Jack Fury's commentary on the STT stuff? Was it good? I will certainly be um, checking that out later on when it's uh, online, if it's not already. Do you know what? I think I'm actually getting better at driving and commentating and doing the old um, channel stuff. I'm not crashing as much as I thought I would in this car. So Shumi says that Drac did a fine job. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Right, I've got one and a half laps to catch RL. And as you can see, I'm really pushing it. RL's no slouch. Oh, he's got it wrong as I say that. Commentator's curse strikes again. Either that or he's just done that to help me catch up. I'm coming to get you! I need some of that special fuel that Jack Kobe puts in his car that makes him go super quick. I'm not sure what fuel it is, but it's jolly good stuff, whatever he puts in it.
Oh, that's totally out of control through there. No, no one did quite hold it. No, no, no. Oh, <laughs> oh my word. <laughs> oh, crikey. Oh, I've got a car coming through. Let's just stay out of the way. Oh, my word. That was... <laughs> I was out of control from the corner before that corner. <laughs> Yeah, Reese said I Mitchelled it. <laughs> oh, my word. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Seriously, I was completely out of control. I was trying to catch her roll 9010. I was really going for it. And I was completely out of control. But, like two to three corners but it was just sliding through each of the corner perfectly and then of course I head straight towards the uh, the concrete bollards at the chicane and that was it all over Terry, are you going to come and uh, race with us? As in, I've got so many friends now on PSN. Um, I don't know who I'm friends with and I haven't, but you, if you want to come racing with us, you're going to need to be a friend of mine or a friend of a friend. Um, so if you are not, jump onto PSN, send me a friend request, and I will accept it. And then it will be a case of just waiting until you can get in the room. I haven't crossed the finishing line. That was a bit rubbish, wasn't it? I was supposed to have done a nice 360 across the line. That failed. <laughs> oh my gosh. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? There's a song in there somewhere, I think. Can't remember the rest of it, so you're lucky. You're not going to have to listen to me. Oh, say, that was good wood. Good wood's ticked off. Hello, Coates. Are you going to settle down or are you looking? Are you going to settle down, mate? You are, aren't you? You're a good boy. I oh, know you haven't been out yet, have you? I'll take you out a little bit later on. Good lad. Good boy. Um, right. Dragon Trail next. Oh. oh. Ninja started already. I got beaten by a 15-year-old. Yeah, well, I'm... Oh! What happened there? Not quite sure what happened there. Um, Dragon Trail. Yes, tonight I'm messing around, mate. You're going to beat me every single day. Every single time. So, um... Come and join me in the in the STCC and beat me in there. Yeah, that's what you need to do. Come and take your dad's place and come and beat me. Uh, Galactical says, spectating on Drax's channel was good. I like the sound effects. Cool. And uh, Gamer Dan says, and they say, hey, 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 what's going on? <laughs> now, I know the song. I can't think of it now. Um... Arrow 9010 is saying sorry to uh, Jonesy. Obviously had a bit of a bit of a thing, I think. Um, Arrow 9010, cards with cages, going to win all night. What's the significance of the cage? That's a new one on me. Are they stiffer or something? Oh. I didn't know that. It isn't. So have I got a, um, how do I know if I've got a roll cage? Because I think the roll cage was added when I put my livery on. 
Ooh. Ooh. Um. I'm just looking. Have I got a roll cage in mine? Ooh. Um, didn't know that. I really didn't know that. Um. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll go to track. Oh, look, I have. Ooh, Mitchell's cheating. Shh, don't, don't tell anybody. Don't tell anybody, but Mitchell's cheating. Ooh, Mitchell Morgan, cheating as usual. Um, okay, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Hey, today is more about just having fun uh, than winning. So I'm not going to lose any sleep over it. Um, but what I will do, just while we are going, I'm going to do the um, qualifier at uh, 22.25, which just gives me a few minutes to go and have a look and see who's running what. So Shumi is in a definitely a bulk standard one, that one. Um, Strangely, he's in a BMW M3. Whoa, what a slide. Whoa. That was awesome. You're going to find a few of these guys that are watching. They're going to flash the lights at me when I'm commentating and, and, and watching them. But that was one brilliant slide through there. Oh, look at that car. It's just born to race. Wicked, wicked, wicked car. Jack Kobe, he is in the uh, mobile one and he has got, he's got a roll cage. He's got a roll, so we're going to have a two tier race, basically. We're going to have uh, um, roll cages versus non roll cages. He's in the Tony Soper car. Oh, he's off, he's off. He's going around. Oh, no, he's saved it. What a save. Look at the smoke coming out of the back of those tyres. Wicked. <laughs> He's showboating now. <laughs> Go on, crash your headlights, mate. <laughs> um, I hope as I'm getting excited and the volume's going up, it's not deafening people. Uh, right, let's have a little look. Oh, Jenky, I love this livery. It's. I'm not going to try and sway Baz because Jenky won the other day. And it had, I mean, it should have gone to me every day of the week, but hey-ho. Um, yeah, Jenky does. It's, it's a beautiful livery. It's very, very simple clean but just a beautiful color thank you for the fashion of the lights mate it's just a beautiful beautiful livery one of my all-time favorites never tire of watching him and unfortunately i don't get to see the front of it very often i'm normally looking at the back of it uh, i think i know the back of every single one of these cars off by heart now uh, then we're on board with Lewis. Lewis is in the Cosworth. Um, there's a couple of Cosworths, I think, out on track. He's in the Labatt. Don't drink and drive livery. Going. Maybe, maybe not a... Um, maybe, maybe, yeah, he's got a, a roll cage in that one. Then you got um, Jack Kobe we had a look at. Uh, Shumi we looked at. Jenki we did. Synth. So Labo is in a bulk standard red car. I'm going to go through this a bit more quickly now. GT Tom is in the Heineken car, again with a roll cage in that one. It's a nice livery on that one. I did ask people to get liveries, so I'm, I'm, I don't mind the fact that some have got liveries with roll cages and some don't. Welsh Boy's got a livery, but no roll cage in his. He's in the Lufthansa uh, car doing a uh, Scandinavian... Uh, flick through that corner. We just managed to catch him. Lovely drift on the way out there. Beautifully held. Loving that. Uh, Junior is in the Demon Tweaks, the blue one. Just on board with him right now. Hey, flashing his lights. Thank you. <laughs> and then he went into the barrier. Oh, my word. Who else have we got? Uh, Carlos Fandango. He's in the black one. Thugs is in the Dulux one. I do like that Dulux car. That looks pretty nice. 
and I know it should be out on track getting some practice uh, back to Jenki uh, Jones is in the other demon tweaks the red one that's a nice looking car so we've got a blue one and a red one for uh, for those two guys so again um, he's got blacked out windows so I can't tell whether he's got a roll cage or not he's been a bit sneaky And I think, uh, oh, and then we've got Speedy B. He's in the taxi uh, liveries that he's been doing. So this is a safety car. So uh, if we get any issues, he'll be out slowing us all down. Uh, and I'm in the pits and Gamer Down is in a monster. And then I think we're through. So I think, I think, uh, I think practice and quality settings are different. Oh, they may well be. It's something I've got to get used to. Um, but I am going to get this one underway because we're two minutes over, but I was just enjoying the liveries there. Let's let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, it's not a safety car, it's a ring taxi. But I think you've got safety car written on the front of it. I think. I'm not sure I'm going to have to have a look now. <laughs> And we've got to be careful, Welsh boy, he's on the Lamborghini this evening. So, um, we're watching out. <laughs> right, let, let's not do the inside view and remind people that we're cheating by having a, having a roll bar, a roll cage. I've got to be honest, I never actually thought about that. That it would give a, uh, give a benefit. I'm hopeless around here. Oh, Fads has um, picked out some winners. When I can get to a convenient point on track, we'll have a little look at those. Uh, so we've got um, Welsh Paul is third. I think he means Welsh Boy is third. I'm second. Woo! 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 I got second. Oh, I like you, Drac. <laughs> or maybe, maybe, maybe that's a tactical decision. I think it might be tactical, but I don't care. I like that. I like that. And the winner, our winner today is Thugs. He did mention Thugs earlier on. Uh, we'll have a look at Thugs in a, a little while. He is our winner for livery today. Whoa! It's a little bit of a thing we're doing on a Friday, just doing a little bit of a boat off to see who's got the best livery. You guys have been warned. Come on, keep it going, keep it going, Mitch. No! <laughs> I can't drift. I cannot drift. I'm now stuck up on the barrier with a whole load of cars going around. <laughs> Oh my word. All right, how are we doing? Oh, now we're following the ring taxi. I need to have a little look. That ring taxi is glitching all over the place. Either that or you've got a very, very, very badly broken back axle. It has, it's got safety car written on the back. I am vindicated. It does have ring taxi all over it. 
But it doubles up as a safety car too. Look, I'm going to get closer. Look, safety car. Dugs, it doesn't matter whether you made it or not. I didn't make mine. Oh, oh, sorry. I, I thought I was following you around, but unfortunately, it's um. Yeah, sorry. Sorry, Speedy. Your car is all over the gut shop, mate. So you might just want to be aware when you've got people close to you it's going left and right like you wouldn't believe why is he doing that I love the show button, but why is it going left? It's just like jerking around. I don't know if you guys can see that on the stream. Or whether that's just me following, I'm not sure. Oh dear, not quite sure what happened there. Oh. I'm faced, yeah, I think I should. I think I should ban Speedy. He's over the place. He's left, he's right. I don't know which way he's going. Got one minute in front, then he's to the left, then he's to the right. It's like, ah! John, I know when you, the, the, you want to, I don't know if you could see it on the, um, on the stream, but your car is literally, you're going straight, it's going left and right, um, I'm getting the, uh, the left and the right for the, the, the flicks, and I'm enjoying it, I don't care, it's fine, it's not a problem, um, Uh, I tried doing the drift challenge earlier on well not earlier on a couple of days ago and, oh I forgot to turn the traction control off that got interesting um, right here we go uh, good luck everybody let's try and keep it clean and I'm talking to myself there because oh I'm all over the place tonight but I'm um, I'm just enjoying myself Chilling out with the lads. Actually, you can really flat out the death chicane if you go into it right. Seriously. Oh, my word. Dare I try that? Dare I try that? Flat out through the chicane of death. Really? Look how rubbish I am. I'm <laughs> right up the front. I'm up with Speedy B and Speedy's been been uh, showboating and just having fun in that car of his. Whoa. I just read that unfazed. 
he's saying about speedy the lag is strong in this one uh, i read that completely wrong i read that the um the force is strong in this one it was like a star warsy vibe that was coming through there oh i'm all over the place again oh again people to the left people to the right oh my god i told you i just cause create complete mayhem when i'm in this sort of mood when i'm i'm streaming on a friday night it's the end of a long week i'm just having fun with all of you guys enjoying the cars enjoying the liveries enjoying the showboating but i seriously can't drive like this so flat out through here right flat out through there next time Massive hit. Big <laughs> old up with those guys. Oh. Speedy's gone through. Right. Okay. I'm going to. Um... No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm going to. Ch I, s I was just about to say, I'm going to channel my inner jedi i've got obi-wan sitting on my shoulder i've got young padwan in the back who's giving me instructions let's get through the chicane of death flat let's prove that it can be done And the biggest clown on track do that and I've got my own Darth Speedius in front of me I have I have right okay as we come around here we're going to start to channel the inner force lightsabers put away I'm going to channel my inner Jedi Force. We're not looking. We're just feeling our way around the track. Oh my word, it works. Look at this, it works. I don't need to look anymore. I just need to channel the Force. May the Force be with me. The Force told me to break there. The Force was wrong. So, how on earth do we go through here flat? I think you've got to get over here flat. I'm not going to lift. 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 <laughs> well, that didn't work, did it? That didn't work. Okay, the challenge has been thrown down. Whoop! Uh, sorry, Synth. Did see you there. Incidentally, there's a massive battle going on up ahead. Look at that. I am going to do the following. I'm going to try one more chicane of death and channel my inner Jedi. And then after that, I'm going to jump up the front and we're going to just enjoy the last couple of laps with that gaggle up front because that looks absolutely amazing so I need to stay far right before it I'm phased is sending the force to me I can feel it it's channeling up through my bones Ugh. That's yeah, a bit too much force. Don't kick me that hard, please. That was a bit too hard. Oh, the force. Ooh, getting a bit uncomfortable there. I know there's um, driving by the seat of your pants, but boy. You don't want the force up there. Come on.
So the chicane is Darth Vader, is it? Still a battle going up front. Mahusive battle. Don't go round. So we stay over to the left. We'll sweep across. We'll stay over to the right. We won't lift. Up lifting. Can you go through the chain cane of death flat? Maybe, but not if you're Mitchell Morgan. If you call Mitchell Morgan, not a chance. Not a chance. With that, I am going to quit. I am going to go spectate. We are going to put on all of the information. And we are going to have a little look and see how things go. So we've got A. Lewis up front at the moment in the Cosworth, closely followed by Jenky Racing. Then we've got Carlos Fandango and Shumi. I'm going to go on the chase cam. And we've got... It's hard to know who to go on board with here. You've got Welsh Boy. It's just behind Gamer Dan. But Gamer Dan is right on the back of Shumi, on the back of Carlos. I think that this is the race that I was looking at so we've got two non roll caged cars the monster cart looks like it might have a roll cage going between the two so does the monster car have a slight advantage I'm not sure I don't care because I'm just loving the racing they're on board with Shumi. Welsh Boy is not far behind, look. I think Welsh Boy could be in this in a moment. I really don't think it's going to be long before he's right there. Go on, Welsh Boy. We know what you can do. So Unfazed just watched Speedy and he went 99% flat through the chicane. But that isn't a hundred percent. I think Speedy needs to go a hundred percent through. Ooh. Oh, Ninja! No point of me racing. Why is that, my friend? You know me pretty good. What's up? Oh, look at this. Oh, no. Oh, I didn't realise you slowed down for me. I did say that I was just going to try the um, the chicane of death and then uh, then I was going to quit out. I, I did say... Because I, I wanted to go and watch these guys. I'm sorry, mate. i tell you what. Where are we off to next? I uh, I'm not sure. Where are we off to next? Um, Sanqua B. Now, I don't know that track. I'm racing you in the next one, my friend. I'm racing you. But this is an awesome, awesome little race up here, up front. You've got Jenky, Gamer Dan, Shumi all together. Just off of the back of them is Carlos Fandango and Welsh Boy. Dan flashing his lights. <laughs> Loving it. Loving it. Oh, look at this. He's right on the back of Jenky. Right on the back of Jenky. And Shumi's right there now, too. Carlos and Welsh Boy having a battle behind. 
I just love this. Look at these cars go. I think there's a thumbnail right there. Gamer Dan still flashing his lights to Jenky. Jenky's going to have none of that. That is not going to phase Jenky one little bit as far as I am concerned. Oh, lovely. Look at that. Do you know what? I, oh, wicked. I often say this. It's like watching professional racing drivers. It really is. Oh, who was that? Was that Jenky going off there? I think Jenky's just balled it. I think he's just binned it. You've got Shumi and Gamer Dan going side by side. Into the chicane of death, but side by side. That's never going to... But, ah, Gamer Dan comes off best. Oh, he's got it really sideways on the exit. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad I'm watching this one. Gamer Dan with a big old slide again through that one. Smoke pouring off the back tyres as he puts the power down. Jenky taking another look at the grass. Oh, are they all going sideways across the line. Look at that. <laughs> oh, look at that for a, a, uh, a little bit of a display. That was synchronised, you guys coming off the line. You guys up front, you need to have a look at the video the uh, the live stream video at the end of that race that was just stunning you were all doing slides across the finishing line the camera was right in the right place and it was just one after the other after the other after the other after the other that was just brilliant 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 Oh, that was just phenomenal. For those of you that are watching the video and are in the chat, give me a double thumbs up if you enjoyed that finish with those guys coming across the line. It doesn't get any better than that, in my opinion. What a race. And sorry to Ninja for... Um, he backed out to race with me. I really apologise for that. But what a finish. Jack Kobe, thank you for waiting for Jonesy and thank you for the apology. I appreciate that, mate. Um, loving it today. It's Mr. Lewis with the Welsh Dragon on his uh, on his overalls. So, A. Lewis in the Sierra Cosworth is your winner. Maybe the Cosy is a bit too much for the BMWs. That's the right way around in my mind. I love that Cosworth. Uh, a 2010 uh, a 2010 for Mr. Lewis, uh, Shumi in second with a two minutes point five. Gamer Dan in third with a two minutes point three. Really tight between you two for for, for the uh, for that lap. Uh, Welsh boy in fourth. Carlos Fandango fifth. Jenky Racing in sixth. Thugs in seventh. M Technic in eighth. Jack Kobe in ninth with the fastest lap of one fifty nine four. RL ninety ten in tenth. Jones eleventh. GT Tom 12, Speedy B 13th, Syntho Labo in 14th, Junior and myself with DNS. And I apologise to Junior for me coming out of that one. Your top three, not that it matters tonight, because this is more about enjoying yourself. And you've seen the showboating. This isn't about winning tonight. But your winner is A. Lewis, Shumi in second, and Gamer Dan in third. Well done to you three. But like I said, it's just a bit of fun tonight. Just a bit of fun. Um, we're off to... Uh, what did I say? San Croix. Where the heck is San Croix? I don't even know it. Um, we've never been here. This is going to be really new to everybody. Uh, so that San Croix B, um, I'm assuming we'll want the normal. That's a long old course. Um, right. Okay. Um, let's... Um, 
let's get to it i guess guys let's see how we go i'm i'm going to try and run this one because it is a course i need to learn um Uh, we've got BOP on, guys, so it, it should regulate it. Uh, the BMW is 234. I think the COSI is 223. Um, so four laps, uh, people are saying for this one. Forgive me, I'm just going to change the lap. The number of laps. Um... Well, I will when I can. There we go. So we'll change that to four laps this one. Yeah, looking for 10 minute-ish races. Uh, on my channel, for those of you that are new around here, um, I tend to try and keep the races short and sweet so that people can jump in and jump out as they want. Uh, and we get quite a lot of that going on. Although Friday night, people tend to get in and stay. Uh, it's just the nature of the way that it is. I know we'll start to lose a few people very, very soon as we hit 11 o'clock. Um, 30 people watching on the stream at the moment. I don't know how many likes we've got, but please hit that like button if you really, really could. It will really help me. Uh, we've got a few Cozzies now. Uh, we've got Lewis Technic in Cozzies. Oh, no, just two Cozzies. I thought I saw three, but I didn't. 27. Oh, three of you, please. Three of you that haven't hit the like button, please hit the like button. Please. Uh, Ninja, can we do a pick race? Yes. Um, where are we off to next? Uh, okay, we're at the um, Daytona Oval. We could do one there. Remind me. At PlayStation Racer, pick at the end of this one. Um, so on this one, we're going to go... Um, no, we're not. We're going to go qualifier at um, 2300. That's going to give us all a few minutes just to get out on track. And I am going to try and race this one because um, Ninja wants to race with me. And I messed him up last time. So I am going to I'm going to see this one through to the end. But I don't know this track, so I do need to get out there. So I, I need to get out there and just run. Run a little bit. I'm seeing in the trap, in the, tr in the trap, in the chat, that somebody took somebody out and asked him why. Can we just straighten it out, please, lads? Uh, Jenky, if you do, um, uh, on, on the, um, chat, Discord should come up. If you do exclamation mark Discord, then it, assuming stream elements is working i'm not sure it is tonight it should come up I'm sorry to hear that, Ashley. Who was it who did that? We are starting to monitor who's doing what. Okay. So we got a card marked. What I would say is uh, check the replay just to uh, see what's what. I've got to get used to saving these replays as well. Problem is, Ninja, if you're behind and I, I, I'm not pointing fingers at anybody and obviously I didn't see the incident, but one of the things that came out recently is um, the car behind needs to 
not hit the car in front and this did come up what happens is somebody pulls over in front of you and hits the brakes my ruling on that i think it was orb that was asking me was that if you are deliberately brake checked so if you're going down a straight and somebody slams the brakes on in front of you then it's tough on the car in front that does the brake check because you're going to hit him however if somebody comes in front of you coming into a corner and slows it down and then takes the race in line and gets through the corner then it's up to the guy behind to not hit them Unfortunately, guys, I haven't got a replay of that, so we can't look at it. Do you know what? I've disabled auto drive. It really shouldn't allow it. I think that's broken in the game as well. It's supposed to be turned off. Auto drive is prohibitive, so it should, I don't understand auto drive. And it's, I don't see any reason why people should go into auto drive, if I'm perfectly honest. I get a bit confused with auto drive, if I'm true. Okay, um, Ashley and Ninja, I would just ask if you get an incident like that, then um, just check the replay and, um, you know, obviously something happened. But for the sake of this evening, can you just shake hands and move on, please? There you go, Drat Fury saying it. Just drop it, it's Friday, stuff happens. And... Um, and uh, yeah, it is Friday. Things happen on a Friday. I said it earlier on. People have had a drink. People are just chilling. Friday stuff happens. Stuff. I've hit three or four people tonight. Uh, nobody is going off at me. Um, and the other thing is, you know, just try not to get onto. Try not to let your car on auto drive. If you want to back out of it, just go round to the pits and just stick it in the pits. Um, so there we go Ashley's got no issue Ninja there you go Ninja doesn't care shake hands guys let's move on thank you that's what we want this is what we want thank you Drac I really appreciate you um, modding that thank you my friend i tell you what I might do we, we are going to go racing in a minute I am I think, I think, have I, oh, I've done all of them, oh, okay, I have done them all, that's a shame, how do we get out of that now? Ooh, just there. Okay. Yeah, guys, we're just going to move on. We're having fun. We don't want to see Moody Mitchell. We don't want Moody Mitchell this evening. 
Right, we've got 16 in the room. room. We're going, we're going, we're going. I did say um, 2300. Let's get this one on the go. Jonesy, any chance of upping the PP to 650 and having racing softs? That has come in just a tad too late. Um, Jonesy, shout that one out at the end of this race and we'll put it to the vote. Crikey, that's noisy. Why have I got that horrible noise in my earphones? Whoa, that has just sent my tinnitus off the scale. Ow. Whoa, that hurt. Um, uh, what was I saying? Um, Crikey, that has really set my ear off. Um, can't even think what I was talking about now. Uh, racing soft tyres. Okay, um, yeah, Jonesy. At the end of this one, if you put out PlayStation Racer in the chat and say racing soft tyres, we'll take a um, we'll take a vote on it. Jenky and I doing what we do best. I need to give him room, and I haven't given him room. Oh, I'm going to let him through. That was a bit. I squeezed him on the barrier. The car went sideways. Sorry, Jenky. <laughs> that wasn't me. Oh, this car is so nice to drive it's even when it's out of control it's it's weird you can still like do stuff with it when it's sliding it's just brilliant for me one of the best cars of the 80s and 90s right up there with the Cosworths the Ford Cosworths this is brilliant I love this. Oh, I'm in the wall. Right, where are we? Are we, um... We are qualifying. Okay. I can't remember what we were doing there. Where's Ninja? I've lost him. Is he on track? Hey Red Dragon, thank you. I hope he's racing in this one. How many times am I going to go head first into that barrier tonight? This is going to take some getting used to this track for the uh, STCC. Incidentally, guys, uh, we could be doing this all next week. One of the first races of the night for those of you that are running the STCC on, uh, I think it's next Friday. I've got to double check the schedule. 
um, but we will be running this so that all of us can get some on track racing practice sort out our strategies and see if we can have a cracking race like we did tonight because that STCC race was just amazing tonight And I think we all did pretty well. Yeah, Terry, I got that completely wrong, that corner. I'm going to be honest. I am not really concentrating enough tonight. Um, all my concentration went into the STCC race, as it should. After that, I've just been out enjoying this car, just running with mates, having some fun. Whoa, that's a corner and a half. Whoa, whoa. Don't hit the barrier, don't hit the barrier. Oh, just kissed it. Oh, Jack, this is the track, if I'm right, and if the guys are right, that we are doing um, next week. Is, is ninja on where's ninja where's ninja where is ninja on junior he's oh he's way up from he's in fifth and i am probably last yeah i am oh i've got some catching up to do um shumi is quick carlos yeah shumi's quick uh jack kobe's quick uh but shumi is quick in just about anything but I tell you what, he is right up there with one of the most respectful people on track. If you can catch him, boy, you can have a race and a half that will have you smiling from here to eternity like a Cheshire cat. Oh, I might have to go and sort my nose out in a minute. Right, good luck everybody. Mitchell Morgan starting where he starts best. Right, where's that young whippersnapper? I'm after him. I'm after him. Oh, I see him. Let's just follow him through this corner so we don't ram him. Right, this is a duel, this one. This is for the bragging rights. On a track I don't know. I don't know if he knows this track. Why have we not done this track before? I tell you what, this track in this car needs to go in the randomizer. What will say you guys? Whoa, look at all these cars through here. Junior, you can't do that. I can't see my, my triangle to break. That's my brake reference. You go over there, I can't see it. That's cheating, that is. Well, it isn't, but I'm the host, and whatever I say goes. Oh, who's got the one second? No! 
It's Janky. I thought he was Junior. Oh, I thought Junior was got a penalty. Now he's running away. No. Right, guys, you need to hold Junior up. Lock him in. <laughs> and no, I'm not. Didn't mean that. I do not want anybody. Oh, oh block him in. Oh, I just hit somebody. Thugs, I'm sorry. Go, 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 thugs. That was me. Sorry. That was all on me. Where's thugs? Sorry. Oh, Junior, I've lost you now. I just clobbered thugs on the way through a corner. I nearly pitted myself then. And that was pitted before anybody says anything else. It's Friday night and I know the way your minds are working. <laughs> oh. Oh no, I could just hear it now. All together. One, two, three. You just got beaten by a 15 year old. <laughs> oh, I can't let it happen. I can't let it happen. Whoa. We've done it again. We've done it again. I completely smashed my engine, look. I've got a half second penalty for smashing a barrier and I've got damage and I've got an engine. I've got Jonesy and Shumi and Welsh boy way out front. Don't hit the barrier. Boy, this is going to take some getting used to. I'm going to have to study some replays, I think, next week. Uh, break at 100 on the bridge. Okay. Why do I always end up facing the wrong way when I do that? Got the wrong line through there. Oh my word. My jeans is going to feel totally different than the GR4s. Game of Dan's, he's at the back, but he's just having a ball, he's having a laugh, and that's what it's all about. For me, this one was supposed to be all about me racing with Ninja, but he's absolutely disappeared on me. He's like left me for dead. Handed it to me, good and proper. Whoa! Okay, that was the wrong gear on my part. 
completely wrong gear. Oh. So, Mr. Fury, you're giving me GR3 braking zones for a 1980s BMW UM Sport on uh, on non-racing tyres. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> and I believed you. Oh my word! Wow, gamer, what a what a slide! Oh, I was I was enjoying that slide too much. I've binned it. How many barriers have I hit tonight, guys? <laughs> I think I've hit more. The uh, stewards and the course clerk of the course are going to be wanting me up in front of them. They're going to want a big old check for barrier repairs, I would think. Oh my word. And I think my own uh, team manager is going to be having words with me over the damage on the car. Front damage, rear damaged. I don't think I've got a non-bent panel tonight. Gamer down, still enjoying himself. God, these cars are great. These cars are brilliant. Now I'm supposed to be racing Ninja, so I'm not going to give up. I'm not going to throw the towel in. I'm just going to continue to race and see how many seconds I am behind him. Oh, we got that lot wrong again. I'm going to try and minimise. I mean, 1.8, 1 minute, 1.8 seconds. I'm 1 minute, 8 seconds behind Whoa, um, the leaders. Penalties are too strong. The penalties should be on weak. Galactical, what trouble have we got on track? Other than me not being able to run it. Gamer Dan's trying to uh, help me to get up with the other guys. Whoa, as uh, as in aggressive or as in Right, uh, who are uh, who are we talking about, Galactical? Who are we talking about? Yeah, I'm actually quite enjoying these tyres, if I'm honest. I can't believe I'm saying that. Okay.
Okay, I might need to. Um, Galactical, I'll have to just do a replay on that one and have a nose. Okay, if Ashley and RL9010 are cool about it, I'm, I'm happy just to move on. At the end of the day, it's Friday and we know it's going to be a difficult. We know that it's going to be difficult on a Friday. Um, uh, so Jonesy was the winner on that one on the 238.6. Thank you, RL. Uh, hopefully Ashley's the same. Uh, Shumi with the fastest lap of 238.3 in second. Jacoby in third. <laughs> okay. Uh, Jacoby in third uh, with a 238.5. Carlos Fandango in fourth. Welsh Boy in fifth. Thugs in sixth. I'm not sure who came seventh. Uh, Jenky in eighth. Uh, A. Lewis in ninth. Synthalabo Labo in 10th, RL9010 in 11th, Gigi Tom in 12th, Gamer Dan in 13th, and the DNS were Technic, Speedy B, and myself. Your top three are Jonesy, Shumi, and Jack Kobe. And it was Junior Ninja who got 7th. And I was, well, I had to back out that one because we had some things going on. Um, but completely, completely crazy that one. Completely, completely crazy. Um, okay. Um, we are going to be heading off to... Where are we in this one? Um, the Daytona Oval. Um, we're doing the Oval Oval, are we? Or, we? or the road course? I think we should do the road course in this one. I don't see this BMW being that good at drifting. So I'm going to go for that track. I'll do four laps of this one again because it is a bit long. Uh, um, we're going to go custom weather and we're going to go midnight. Um, and um, we are saying... Um, can I get a thumbs up if you want to do the oval? And a thumbs down if you want to do the road course. Yet yeah, Ninja, we're going to do the pick. Oh, Jenky, don't disappear for a minute. Let's let's get you in the in the picture. Um. Um. Blah, blah. Right. Let's just go. Um. I want to do this really, really quickly. So one lap. Um, I'm going to do this as afternoon for the photograph. Uh, I think we're all good. Um, and somebody said about the. Um, yeah, Kobe, we're definitely going to be racing. We're definitely racing, but what we we'll do. Um, Ninja, can you take me round to wherever we're going to do this? Because I think you know. Um, all we're going to do, Jack, is uh, a photograph. So we do. We go round. We do the photograph. Some of the guys will um, would we'll, we'll just save the replay. I mean, I often do it, but I've whether I do today or not, I don't know. Um, so we do a photograph and then we'll go in and I'll reset the room and we'll do a proper race. So no, we're definitely still racing. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm good for another hour or more. And we've still got... Um, we've got the Oval, Suzuka, Nords and possibly even Watkins Glen to do.
Oh, bother. Hang on a minute. Um. Right, as soon as I've got everybody back in, we'll head round. I'll just start the race and we'll go straight to wherever it is that we've got to go. I think we may have one or two people that are heading off to get liveries. And I am going to wait for you guys. So we're looking for Shumi and Jenki at the moment. I really must get used to doing the, the replays, guys. It's, it's one of the things I must start doing. Junior, you're going the wrong way. Oh, you're going to do a jump. Oh, is this where we're going to do it? Okay. That's where we're going to do it, but... Um, so something's up with my room setup. Uh, MTech, what's up with the, the room setup? Right, I think we're all in. Let's just get going on this one. Um, Mtech, if you can let me know in the chat what's up with the with the setup, I'll get it sorted. Right, don't bash your cars up, guys. Try and keep them clean. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Right, guys, come back, come back, come back, come back. I reckon it'd be quite nice to be on the front of this Daytona -y thing. Right, so basically, we need to get everybody to line up. Um, yeah, Ashley, don't worry, you won't be ghosted. So long as you don't overlap another car, you'll be fine. You just need to make sure that you don't overlap another car. Um, so the Cosy that's close to me, you're fine now, I think. But basically, if you just look left and right on your uh, stick, then you should be fine. Also, if you put the radar on, you should be able to see it as well. I just probably need to roll forward just a little bit. There we go. Right, 
I'm just waiting for the last couple of cars just to get in line. So just look left and right and make sure that you are that you're not overlapping somebody. I think we look good. Right, just waiting for the last couple just to finish moving. <laughs> I tell you what, it's not the easiest. Hopefully, we're not overlapping each other. Right, is everybody in the place? I think they are. Okay, let's go, guys. Now you can bash everybody, you can showboat, you can do what the heck you like. Ninja, you're going around, my friend. Somebody... <laughs> oh, I need, I, need to, I need a bump, I need to catch... Oh! <laughs> oh, I'm going to get Ninja. Uh, no, I'm not, I'm going around. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <coughs> right. Who could get to the end with all this carnage going on? Oh, no, I couldn't, couldn't go through there. It's not fair. I thought I'd be able to skip through there. Do a little bit of a shortcut. Oh, I've never noticed all those flags before. Well, I'm going to try something crazy. Traction control off. Yeah, as I said, I can't drift. I cannot drift to save my life. I think it's amazing you guys that can drift. What on earth is happening with Speedy's car? It is jumping up and down. What is going on with that car? beats me in a blooming smashing match. I can't even beat him when I'm trying to smash him off the track. God. What it's like to be 15 and young, hey? Tap handbrake, opposite lock. Feather power and go left, right. <laughs> oh, track, you make it sound so easy, my friend. Right, okay. Um, silliness over. We're back to normal. Um, somebody was saying I've got a problem with the setup in the race. I'm not quite sure. Um, Ashley, yeah, I've normally got TCS1 on. I'm trying. I'm trying to get to the point where I am not running with traction control, um, but for the moment I am running traction control one. Um, it's saving me in, in races and when I turn it off, I get into problems. So uh, yeah. Right. So um, we're going to go um, five laps of this one, I think. 
Um, custom weather, we're going to go... Uh, I'll go night rather than midnight. Um, Kian, we will be doing the Nuremberg Ring. Uh, we're doing this one. Then we've got Suzuka. Then we've got Watkins again and Nordschleifer. I might do the Nordschleifer in a minute and then do the other two later. So that uh, those of you that want to do the Nordschleifer but then get off, you can. Um, bum, 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 bum. Uh, rain at the Nordschleifer? Yeah, we can do that. So I'm, I'm just a bit concerned. Uh, somebody was saying that the settings were wrong, but I'm not seeing anything that's too off in this. If I'm honest, it sort of looks reasonably okay to me. Just going through. Um, you don't, you won't get rain in America. I don't think there's any rain in any of the American circuits. Unless I'm wrong. But I don't think I've ever seen rain on the American circuits in the in the in here. Uh, Shimmy five laps. Um. You want penalties off? Um, shortcut penalties on. Car collision penalties on. Um, most of the others are off. Walls off. So I'm just going with the ones that we normally do. Um, we are slowest first. I'm just going to go for it. Uh, I'm just going to go for it. Mtech is saying your YouTube is back on. Don't quite understand that. Um... Jack, what's been on the whole time? I'm losing the plot here. I don't know what's going on. It was down. Um, I haven't seen it go down. Ooh. Um... I'm going to get this one going really, really quick. I'm going to go at 40. So almost straight away. Are you talking about the original one that was... It failed. The original YouTube... Um, uh, stream did fail. Yes, I had no uh, audio at all. Either in the game or me talking. Um, okay, thank you guys for confirming everything's all okay. Uh, Mtech, I think it must be you, my friend. I am going to be back in less than a minute. Bear with me a second, guys. Right. Ah, I just um, had to blow my nose. I've got the microphone back on. Good boy, you stay in your bed. I'm going to take you out in a little while. Good boy. Yeah, good lad. Um, I think uh, Code is wondering where the uh, where the girls are. All right, here we go. Right, back to sensible now, guys, please. 
sensible racing or as sensible as we can make it. And I've got to chase Ninja wherever he is. Matt, is that the uh, the STCC results? I don't want to know because I'm going to be falling way down the pack. I was quite pleased with the way I did. Oh, cool. I was pleased with my performance tonight. I was not disappointed. I thought I would be racing for mid-pack, so to get up there was, was good. A little bit disappointed with the last one. No way! Really? No way! You're having me on. You're like, you're, you're winding me up. You're winding me up. I'm trying to race here. <laughs> Drac, I won't be waiting till, till um, breakfast. I'm going to be watching them later on. When I go to bed, I'll be watching them on my phone. You'll be sending me to sleep, my friend. No, I'm still top. Yes, yes. <laughs> that, my friends, is for all of you that have helped me over the last two weeks to nail Barcelona. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> If you guys are winding me up, I am going to be so miffed. You, I won't stream for a month. Oh no, look, I've binned it now. I'm getting too excited. <laughs> I smashed my engine as well. <laughs> oh my God. No, seriously. You've got to be winding me up. You've all got to be winding me up. But you've got... I've... Dan was in there. I mean, I know that Jack was racing for the first time. No way. Oh my God. Thank you, Matt. That has made my day. Wow. Oh my word. Oh, so I'm, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, I can't race this. I, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm just gonna sit and enjoy the other guys racing for the moment. I just, I need to process that. That's completely thrown me. That has completely, completely thrown me. Seriously. Oh, wow. Oh, seriously, guys, that is for all of you out there that have been helping me over the last two weeks. I'm not going to name names. You know who you are. Uh, do, do you know, I come on here. I'm just enjoying watching these cars racing around it. Oh, look at this. Jack Kobe and RL. Look at that. Look at that. Uh, the next one is uh, we're going to do the Nords next, Jack, because one or two people want to head off. We're going to do the Nords next. Um, <sighs> oh, do, do you know, you guys, you, you come and join me every night during the week and you watch me throwing it off and crashing. And just, you know, some people actually DM me and go, why do you do what you do? You're rubbish. You can't race for toffee some people say it's entertaining because they're just seeing me crash all the time um but it's it's just nice to get out there after a lot of hard work to put a performance in and to show that i'm not the best but i can race and i thoroughly enjoy it and i love it and i love what i do i, I love what we do on the lobby um and just entertaining and chilling and just doing what we do um and i love watching this 
you know, this, this is every bit as good as watching the British touring cars back in the 80s, I tell you. And, um, but to be able to go out there four rounds and head the table is just beyond my wildest dreams. And genuinely, 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 this is down to everybody that has helped me over the last couple of weeks. If you'd seen the way I was racing at Barcelona when we first started, it was woeful. I very nearly backed out of the race and I was going to give it over to somebody else that could actually race it. Now we're off to San Croix and I've got to do it all again. I need to learn the track. I've got to race with you guys. I've got to study the replays. I've got to work hard and I will work hard. Um, but that is just, Matt, that has made my day absolutely made my day oh. wow so I'm just enjoying these cars at the moment and trying to take that in yeah I realised we're talking about that wow Um, somebody just mentioned how much do I get from YouTube um, a lot less than you think and um, I am still so far out of pocket with all the gear that I've had to get to do this live stream um, I think um, it's going to be a good year or two before I recover the money you don't make money on YouTube really not, not unless you've got a large fan following or you're pulling in millions of views. Uh, for what we do with Gran Turismo, there's so many people out there doing it, you, you're not going to make much money on it. Um, you don't have the big advertisers spending either. Uh, I have a number of members that um, support me and I appreciate all of those. Um, but everything I am getting and more a lot lot more is going into the channel and equipment and gear and stuff like that um, I've probably be put three to four three to four times the amount that I'm getting from ad revenue and memberships than I am than, than I put in uh, um, I've put in three to four times the amount and yes um, I mean when you go when you earn I think it's when you earn more than a thousand pounds in the UK you have to register self-employed um, I have registered self-employed because I have other interests uh, photography and a few other bits and pieces although photography is taking a slide now um, but I am way 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 off needing to submit a um, return at the moment and if you start looking at the amount that you earn per hour it literally is pennies per hour um, given the amount of time and effort that you put in so if you were to look at the investment in equipment and you were to look at the investment in time Oh, look at this. Welsh boy and Ian are, are, are both in the same, the same livery. Look at that. That's wicked. Wow. Uh, yeah, if you look at the amount that you put in in, in equipment that's needed and um, the time that you put in, it's, it's pennies per hour. Uh, it's Whoa! Kian's got it way wrong. I thought he was going to hit the tyres there. Just enjoying this. I, I still can't take in. 
Matt's just saying, hey, I learned from all the tips too. A lot of us learned. A lot of us learned a lot of stuff over the last two weeks from everybody that was helping me stroke us to get better for Barcelona. And do you know what? I think we had a much better race for it. There was far less incidents. There was a lot of really, really good racing at Barcelona this week. Um, and I'd like to think that a lot of that was from the practicing that we have been doing within my community or our community, not my community, our community. Um, I think that we all put a lot of time and effort in to get better. And I'm hoping we're going to do that this week. Vargo, good night, my friend. Thank you. I really appreciate it. If you haven't already, please smack the like button on the way out. I do. I love the Cosworth. There you go. There's a Cosworth for you. Uh, good night to everybody that is disappearing. I appreciate that it's now coming up for midnight in the UK. And um, I really appreciate everybody that's been racing with us this evening. Uh, it's been brilliant. I've probably, probably thoroughly loved it. Keep hands going across it backwards. Uh, a. Lewis with a big old slide. Thank you, Nige. Thank you, Jack. I think you're heading off to... Good night, good night, good night. What was that race that we were going to put in the randomizer? Oh, which one was that? That was um, St. Croix B, wasn't it? St. Croix B in the BMW M389. I'll pop that one in the randomizer as soon as I can. Right, that's... I've calmed down a little bit now after that shock. Um, and believe me, that was a shock. Um, a very, very nice shock, but a shock nonetheless. And um, I am going to get back to racing. And we're heading off to the Nordschleifer just to try and get that in before everybody calls it a night. Just two laps and I'm going to try and finish it. Um, and I am going to go with racing soft tyres just for a little bit of extra grip unless okay let me just say um can i get a thumbs up if you want to go with racing tires and a thumbs down if you want to go with sports tires very quickly in the chat whilst i'm doing this so thumbs up for racing thumbs down for sports Right, we're heading off to the Nordschleife. Uh, two laps. I'm going random, so I don't know what's going to happen in the weather. It could be wet. It might not be. Who knows? Who knows? Thumbs down. So we want to stay with the sports. Okay, we'll stay with the sports. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. Um, ah, fiddlesticks. I've got a few people initialising at the moment. Thank you to everybody that has raced this evening. It's been brilliant. Thoroughly enjoyed it. And thank you also to those of you that um, had some difficulties on track and you sorted it out amicably amicably in the chat i thank you thank you from the bottom of my heart for sorting that out um for the moment i can't change the settings uh there's a lot of people coming in at the moment sorting themselves out okay where are we let me just wait so we're waiting for, uh, yeah, it should let me in, even though you guys are getting cars, so it should let me in. 
to change the room settings. Oh, I'm a bit confused. A little bit confuzzled. Some player, who's still initialising? Um, we've got 16. Oh, the upswing. Racing soft swim. Okay. We'll, we'll make that change too. We will make that change. We will go with the majority decision and we'll go back to the sports afterwards. Hopefully, it'll let me change now because at the moment, it's not letting me. I'm going racing all. Oh, come on, guys. What is going on? Um... Can you guys grab cars? Because this is not letting me change the uh, room for some reason. I need Welsh boy, Faz, myself. Uh, Welsh boy, Faz, Jonesy, Thugs and Tom. Unless the room is glitched, as Kian is saying. Maybe the room is glitched. Because we should be able to make the changes. At this point, it doesn't look like there's anybody initialising. I think you might be right, my friend. If this doesn't work, I'm going to upset everybody. I think it's glitched. I think it's glitched. What say you? I'm going to try one last time. If this doesn't work, then I'm going to have to reset the room, I'm afraid, gentlemen. And ladies, if there's any ladies in the room. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to do that. I'm just going to try one last time. And then we'll close and reopen. That's, that's goosed. Sorry, guys. I'm going to have to reset the room. Right, this is going to be a one, two, three, go for everybody to get in. I hate to say it, but somebody is going to um, lose out here. Playwright, have a good one, mate. Thank you ever so much. And thank you for the hosting the STCC so beautifully and wonderfully. Um, thoroughly, thoroughly enjoying it, my friend. Thoroughly, thoroughly enjoying it. It's absolutely brilliant. Um, create the room. Uh, I'm going to load the settings. Randomizer races. And then we're going to go for... I'm going to get all this set up before any of you guys can get in. Just so that we know what's going on. Custom weather. If you guys see anything that I've missed... Then tell me as we go through here. Custom weather, random, 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 rolling start. Um, that's one of the things we want to do is practice some race. BOP is on, some settings, boost, zip stream, visible damage. And uh, then we come down here. So we need to up the PP. I'm not quite sure what it should be, but Jonesy's saying 660. Is that still a stock car, Jonesy, at that? Seems a little bit high, but never mind. I'm going to put everybody on soft. Um, it's a soft tyre, 660. Uh, um, I think we are all done. Shortcut week, car collision done. Pit lane, don't need to worry about too much. I'm assuming 660 is for the um, Q 
key and yeah we're still using the m3 it's still the same car but i think that's to accommodate the car the tires we'll work it out in a minute i've set it to 660 and we'll see what my pp is when i enter with the correct tires i tell you the oh that's going to be a pain oh i look i might lose my microphone um before the evening's out because it's flashing red at me at the moment uh, which probably means it's failing uh, so I'll, I'll run until I'm tired or until the microphone goes if the microphone does go guys that yes it is wireless if the microphone does go I will wave and say goodbye <laughs> um, right so car settings um, I don't even have those tyres. Oh, you're making me spend more money, guys. Please note, it wasn't me that's making you spend the money this time. Right. It doesn't need to be 660. Five forty six. Well I'm at five thirty four. So I'm gonna go with a five forty six. Um Okay, five forty seven. Yeah, just go over. actually what i'm probably gonna do go 550 so we don't get into the same shenanigans i had earlier on it won't let me change it There we done, we done. Okay. Yeah, I'm 534. I think some of it is down to possibly the um the body kits that people have got on. I think if you've got more aero or something, it might be pushing it up. Oh, Gamer Dan has lost out. Sorry, the, the actual lobby crashed, my friend. Oh, sorry, Gamer Dan. Um, I'm going to go 10 pass that gives everybody five minutes of running time just to try and get a grip of this car on this track um malkovich are you racing because if not i think gamer dan would like yeah okay so yeah we've got 16 and 16 in uh dan i'm sorry The thing, Technic, if we turn the track limit off completely, then um, people are just going to cut the corners all the time. Um, no, we haven't got Quali. Quali's turned off. 
quality is turned off so um, it'd be silly to do qualifier here it's whatever the game wants to set it as Oh, I did, didn't I? No, I'm getting, I am relaxed. I am chilled and I'm not even thinking straight. I am, I am blown away by that result just earlier on. I can't, I cannot, I still cannot get over it. Um, me, little old me, still at the top. Uh, Technic, there's too many of us who do not know this track well enough. I'll tell you that for now. Um, I mean, no disrespect to anybody, and I'm not going to name names, but I can go down this list and um, I include myself in this. There are four of us that track penalty limits are going to kill us. They're going to absolutely kill us. Um, in fact, I also want to make sure I've got the wall off. Wall one's off. Yeah, wall is off. Car collisions is on. Um, shortcut penalty is weak. I am happy with what we've got. I haven't even got the boost on. The boost is off. Because that did spoil things. Uh, game it down, there won't be any DNFs because if anybody rage quits, they're out of it. Uh, Dan, if you want to continue to race, I'm pretty sure we will probably lose a few people after this one. I think there's a few people sticking around just for Nords and then they're going to be heading off. Um, I appreciate it means that you're not in this one and I'm sorry for that, but unfortunately that was how things fell for me. Um, that said, there's a couple of people asking if you want in. I think they're prepared to give up place. So Drax finishing after Nords. Um, I, I think there could be a few that will disappear. I think, uh, Dan, if you want to race Nords, give a shout out. Okay, thank you. Right, less than a minute, guys. Less than a minute. Oh, it's been magic tonight, everybody. Absolutely rock solid, brilliant, wonderful, great. I loved it. Absolutely loving it. Right, don't anybody change your cars right now because we are going live in a moment. Oh, we've just had somebody drop out. Dan, do you want to come in? Ninja's got to go. Good night, Ninja. Thank you ever so much for racing this evening. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't get my race with you, but there's always another night. I'm going to come and get you, young man. I'm going to come and get you. I promise I'm going to get better. And I'm going to... I am going to have all over my car. You've just beaten by a 50 plus year old. I will get my own back. You have a good one, my friend. You have a good one. Um, right, guys, I'm just giving it a moment for Gamer Dan to join us. Yeah, no worries, Jonesy. Good night, Ninja. Thanks ever so much for racing. I really apologise for bailing on you during that race and for spoiling your race. I didn't realise what was going on. Unfortunately, there's just so much going on on the stream. Um, yeah, it's just one of those things. Uh, oh, you beat me all night. I know. I know. You don't have to rub it in. I'm just rubbish. <laughs> but I'm going to get better. I am going to get better and I'm going to beat you one of these days. And I am going to shout it from the rooftops. 
Jimmy, not fair. <laughs> Speedy's in a ring taxi. Yeah, but how many punters has he got? <laughs> how many people has he got on board? Uh, Dan, are you joining us? Yes. Yes, welcome back. Welcome back. I'm going to get this underway straight away as soon as Game of Dan sorted. Yes. Wicked. Okay, we've got everybody back in. Cool. Thank you, Ninja. Have a really, really good night and a good good day at work tomorrow. Um, let's go, everybody. Let's go. And well done for beating me every single race tonight. But you cannot take away. I'm a happy, 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 happy man. Because the STCC went absolutely brilliant. And I can't believe I'm still top. I'm still top. It won't be for long. But it's still there. Oh, Here we go. Right. If anybody crashes, Speedy's going to pick you up. Speedy drives a taxi because he thinks he's Sabine Schmitz. <laughs> That no, that that that's my that's my line of the night. That one now, I'm afraid. I like that. Any reference to Sabine at the Nurburgring is good by me. Sadly missed. And forever the Nurburgring queen. Nice number plate, Paz. <laughs> I'm slowly falling to the back, but I really can't drive this around here. Whoa, I've just seen my name come up, but I don't know what it's all about. Looks like Jonesy's falling to the back to race with somebody. Thank you, Jonesy, for that. Ninja, we've done 1980s nights, but I'm more than happy to do another one. Because they always go down well. And they're proper, proper driver's cars back in the day. Oh, I'm being chased down by Jonesy. He's got to run on me. I need to leave some room on the outside. Where on earth is that speed come from? Oh, I need to leave some room. Need to leave some room. I, oh, it's going round. Oh. Backed it into the gravel. Oh, Jonesy's out of control. Look at this. Stint is in the bin as well. Arm racing GT time again. I don't know those two cars. Hit me up on Discord, my friend. But you need to uh, get some shut eye if you've got work tomorrow. So if I keep talking to you, yeah, Dad's gonna. Oh, I got into the back of Tom. Sorry, Tom. Oh my word, this is hard. This car on the Nords. I'm gonna have to concentrate. I'm going quiet. I'm going quiet, guys. Good night, Ninja. Oh, M Tech's off. Is our role really up the front showing us all how to do this again? Mind you, he's up there with Shumi. I tell you what, that is going to be a race and a half to watch. Those two are constantly sparring around here. And it's amazing to watch. If I remember, at the end of this, I'm going to do a replay. And I'm going to enjoy that. Although I, I am determined to finish this tonight.
but I'm so tempted to go and have a look up front. Let me see if I can chase down Jonesy. Let's concentrate. Think about this. Oh, why did M Tech rage quit? Or has he had a technical issue? Didn't count my corners enough. Right, let's stand this BMW on its nose, get it turned in. Okay, it sounds like uh, MTEX had a uh, technical issue. So uh, that's cool, that's not a problem, my friend. Hope you, you, hopefully, you can get it sorted out. That is not a rage quit. I apologise for calling it as such. But thank you for letting us know in chat. That's all I need. Communication goes a long old way. Really helps uh, hosts of, uh, of lobbies to know what's going on. Let people do that. I'm going to be falling into the clutches of Malkovich now. I hear you, my friend. I hear you. But I can't find the horn button on my on my controller right now. Whoa! That was sideways! Did you see that? That was right up on two wheels. Oh my word, I gotta check that out on the replay. Drac, my friend, I think you've just got another one of those little clips that you love doing. I swear my car was actually up on two wheels for a good two or three seconds there. Unless I was dreaming it, which I could be. Slowly learning this track. Still got a lot more to learn on it. Right, we've got this really tight right hander going up the hill to the uh, tight left. Oh, I love this car! What an awesome little car this is. Ian Bindet. Why have we never done this before? Jones is in the bin. This is just... This car just puts a smile on my face all the time. Oh, we're on racing soft tyres. Was it racing soft at one, was it? I think it was. Oh, racing soft. This is awesome on racing soft tyres, I tell you. Welcome back, MTech. We've got the two cars in front, a slip streaming each other. Unfortunately, I'm not quite getting... Oh, I'm getting a slip right at the end.
Oh no, I didn't slow it down fast enough. God, that was a three, 360 bump off the barrier, that was. Oh, look at the damage on my car. My poor little BMW is just smashed to pieces. God, even when you're out of control on this car, you can still gather it up. It's so forgiving. I mean, when it goes, it goes. Like, going across the grass is never going to work. Um, yeah, when you lose it, you lose it. But if you lose it, but you don't lose it, if you know what I mean, I know it sounds crazy, it's just sublime. It's just awesome. See, through there, that was a full-on slide. It's just, yeah, it's just an amazing little car. BMW, when you created this, you created a masterpiece. Didn't quite hold that one. Oh, Mr. Fury's gone round. Where's RL? He's not on the leaderboard. We've got Shumi, Lewis and Welsh boy. Has there been an issue? Up the front, I wonder. Oh, managed to hold that one. Hey, we're up with the ring taxi. I need, I need a lift, mate. That's probably about the only way I'm going to get to the end. Are you up for fares? How much do you charge? How much? That much? Oh, it's because if you hit the barrier, it costs so much. Now I understand. Oh, it's a bit rich for me, though. There you go. You see, I just smacked the barrier. Maybe I should just, maybe I should just gone in the taxi. Maybe I should have just gone in the taxi. It'd have been cheaper, wouldn't it? The way that taxi's being driven, I reckon there is Sabine in it, you know. I need her in here with me. Racing and showing me how to uh, get this car around the Nürburgring without crashing it. Oh, GT Tom in the wall. Oh, the car in front all over the place too. I'm going around again. That's another front end required. Another barrier to be fixed. It's this little section that I struggle with. I think I'm breaking, well, I know I'm breaking way too late. And again there, it's another corner that gets me. Mr. Fury, showboat in. Mr. Morgan getting it all wrong. Come on, clean up the front damage. Thank you. Crikey, we're one minute, 22 seconds away from Shumi, that's insane. How on earth are you that far down the road? We're not even get it, get it, going to get to finish this one. Mind you, I have whacked the barrier just once or twice. Oh, more yellows. Oh, drag, how did you hold that?
GT Tom right behind me as well. Where on earth have you come from? Oh! Commentator's curse again. Oh, now we caught up with Malkovich. Oh, I nearly caught the back of him. Just about managed to get through there. Oh, Drac all oh, sideways there. No! Oh, it's going so well. Now we've binned it. There are places where I'm getting used to this track and there's still some corners that are catching me out. We'll get there. Jumped out of the carousel there. Go oh, on, trying to catch Jonesy. Not going to, though, I don't think. Assume he's already crossed the finishing line. We're not going to get to finish this, guys, are we? GT Tom, thank you for the bump. Come on, stay with me. Whoa. No, <laughs> track was just going full pelt sideways into the barrier and it stopped. Oh my word! RL ninety ten nearly flipped two times cornering. I had it right up on two wheels at one point. Yeah, for this remain time should be more. Yeah, I, I, I realised that. Um, I realised that my mistake on that one um i ain't gonna do the replay on that and uh, your winners um you guys are going to remind me when we do the noise cipher i need to move the the finish time up quite a lot good night synth uh Shumi was your winner on that one a 7.42.6 uh a lewis in second uh the gamer down in third so it's worth dropping back in for a podium welsh boy in fourth thugs in fifth RO 9010 in 6th, Speedy B in 7th, Jonesy in 8th, Jack Fury in 9th, I got 10th, Malkovich 11th, Ian in 12th, GT Tom in 13th, Faz in 14th, Synth in 15th, and M Tech was a DNF. Um, I tell you what's quite interesting, it's a bit of a discussion going on about tyres, whether racing softs or sports softs are best for that particular race. I actually quite like the racing softs on that particular one. But Shumi was your number one winner on that one. A. Lewis in second and Gamer Dan in third. Right, let's um, let's just go back to some...
Okay. Right. Um, can you guys still hear me? Can you hear me now? Yeah, I think you can. Woo, it worked. Nice one. Uh, um, Drac, they're wicked, but you're going to have to take a deep breath before you see the price of them. They're well worth the money, in my opinion, well worth the money, but they ain't cheap. Um, yeah, my oil is probably completely wrecked in this car, if I'm honest. The trouble is I can't go out and, and, and do the oil on mine because um, I have to shut the room down to do it, which is a bit of a shame. Uh, so very often what I'll do if I'm doing a race night like this, I'll often get two or three cars and spec them up. I have got some more BMWs, but they're not stock. Um, at least I don't think they're stock. Uh, Ashley's doing one more and then he's off to bed. This is a good one, this one. Um, car settings, so we're going back to Sports Soft. Um, I don't know what other BMW 89s I've got. Um, I am probably cooking the engine in this one. Uh, I've got another 498. Oh no, that's the one I'm in. Uh, see, my other one is a 502. That one's had work done on it. I've got a 556. I've got three, but this is the only one that's stock. So we'll we'll cook the engine in it. If I've got to buy a new engine, I'll have to buy a new engine. Um, and I'm going straight into the race for this one because we are starting to get a little bit late. And I'm going to start this one at... Um, I'm going to give you... I ought to give you five minutes, really, just to make sure that we know what we're doing around this track. Uh, good night to everybody that we are losing at the moment. We're down to 11 runners now. We are getting towards the end of the night and I knew we were going to lose people around this time. Um, so thank you ever so much. Uh, what I am going to do is get straight into this one uh, as quickly as we can. I'm just waiting for M Technic and GT Tom to grab cars. And then we'll get this one underway in four minutes time. Um, this could be a really, really good race, this one. Could be a really good race uh, at this track. Quite technical. Um, quite long for this car, but I think this could be pretty good fun. Uh, I could open the room up to public, but I'm enjoying the respectful racing too much tonight. Really enjoying it. What I need to do is make sure I charge up my um, my microphones. Um, incidentally, Drac, assuming I think you're still around, 
if you do go for the uh, D, uh, the DJI microphones that I've got, it comes in two lots. You can get one with a single microphone and another one with a double. I went with the double. Um, and one of the reasons I went with the double is it comes in this little little box. I don't know if you how, whether you can see that. It comes in the little box. And um, when you start them up, if you've got the receiver and the transmitter in the box, it will bond them together. But the other thing it will do, and if you can see on there, the lights on the front, is it charges them up. So this double unit with this box did 28 hours straight without needing to charge it up, which blew me away. Um, because I ran them both down. But when it ran out, I put it in the box. That one there that's now run out that I was wearing is now charging from the box. It's wicked. It's expensive, but it is pretty good. Um, it really is. Uh, just losing a couple of other people. I think uh, there might be a few people that may well think the Suzuki is a bit too much for this car. Uh, so I am uh, not surprised that we will be losing a few few people plus it's getting very late um, so we were going to do uh, Watkins Glen after this one or it might be that we just call it a day I'm not quite sure because um, it is getting a bit late so we've got just under two minutes and then we will be racing guys just under two minutes I'm just waiting for Technic to grab a car um, maybe they're not racing but i am going to start this at 22 regardless of whether you're ready or not technic oh. oh what a night tonight has been it's been wicked really really good night i've thoroughly enjoyed this one Uh, show me am I doing no I'm not doing that my problem with the manufacturers and the nations and all of those um, I struggle to find the time to do them I keep entering them but then I do like one race and that's it um, because I'm busy on Saturday when they're running and on the Wednesday I can't get in my room during the day because Lauren works in here and I can't be in here when she's working because of data privacy regulations um, and then of course in the evening I'm just taking the dog out having dinner spending just a an hour or two with Joe and then I'm into the stream so whilst I'd love to do them and I will do them at some point uh, and that's something else I'm thinking about at the moment I can't entertain them um, which is a real shame it is a real shame but hey ho it is what it is Right, we're at 22. Oh, we've lost, the Faz is gone. Um, yeah, I've only gone five, five laps, which is odd. What's wrong with five laps? RA272 in Nations, what a wicked choice. What a wicked choice that is. Oh, wouldn't it be fun if PDR copying us? Wouldn't that be amazing? If somebody out there is actually looking at our lobby and the way that we're doing stuff and they're looking at the randomizer and getting ideas, could the randomizer be coming in a future release of Gran Turismo? Wouldn't that be awesome? And the ability to save more than 50 races. That would be awesome. The thing is with the randomizer is they need to do very very little to put a randomizer of sorts in there I've gone completely off track there it's not hard for them to do it because they've already got the technology for saving races all the races are then numbered you just hit a button that says give me a random one from your library Bob's your uncle It'd be brilliant for streamers like me or people that are hosting lobbies because all the races are pre-canned 
you haven't got to worry about whether you've got the right tyres and the right um, fuel and tyre settings and everything else. It would be fabulous. And I've actually been looking and I've failed up to this point to see if there's anywhere where you can actually suggest uh, enhancements to the game. Because I'd like to put it in there. The, pro the thing with our randomizer, we've got around about 70, 80 races in there now. But I can only map 50 into the game. So if one of those first 50 comes up, happy days. If it's above the 50, then I have to manually configure the race each time. So if we were able to can or predefine a lot more races, we could have a lot more variety. So, um, if any of you out there know somewhere where you can submit requests to PD, let me know. Oh, I nearly took Welsh Boy out there. <laughs> I'm loving this battle up front. Look at it. What, we got three cars there, four cars all there battling. Whoa! Yeah, okay, got that one a bit wrong. I was enjoying the race up front too much. I binned it. That's alright, I'm going to have a race with my mate GT. trouble with driving this car on the limit is when you get it wrong boy does it bite you you are off to the shadow realm and then some oh GT's got a penalty That's gonna enable me to close up oh has he got a penalty he's just disappeared I oh, know he has got a penalty. But he's too far away. He's too quick. We got Malkovich in front. Oh, they've both got penalties. Is that going to enable me to close up a little bit? I think it might do actually. Oh, don't get it wrong, Mitchell. Don't get it wrong. What an awesome little car. I think I might have said that once or twice already. Oh, I've gone into there too big and too heavy again. Hey, hey, look at that on the back of that. Morgan, I'm up to four stars. I'm no longer one star. Yay!
How am I going to earn that last star? I'm also loving how quick GT Tom's got. As soon as that consistency comes in, he's going to be right up there with the best of the best. And we're going to be having some good old fights on his journey up there. we're in now I'm coming to get you my friend I am coming to get you to Technicones he owns I did I didn't see that it flashed up and went I'm assuming he owns the BM up come on come on two laps to get this done struggle with my breaking point yeah how on earth did you carry that much speed through there GT every time I catch him he goes away oh E30s are the best yeah, great cars. I do like the BMWs, I have to say. I always wanted one of these back in the 80s, but I never had the money. They were expensive back then. And then I've had a few BMWs at the M3 Touring, which I loved. Brilliant car. Then I had a um, E86 Z4 and then I had the new Z4 as in the new new one I missed the hard top and that was a stunningly good car wicked car but I'm in a battle here I need to concentrate on what I'm doing because Tom is 1.6 ahead and I'm not closing got it down at 1.3 we're still chasing Malkovic this has been a little three-way battle for ages hi King Weirdo how are you doing I'm just trying everything I can at the moment to catch GT Tom. And it's taken me a whole lap to catch him back up. And I'm still not there. It's still seven tenths of a second down the road. GT Tom is so quick through that corner. It 
This is the last lap. I am running out of time. Do you know what? Yes, we had an off. But other than that, I'm struggling to catch him. That consistency is there, you know. I'm doing the guy in injustice. And it's me with a consistency issue. I've binned it. I've binned it. No. Yeah, King, there are. We've had quite a few people that have um, just called it a night because it's uh, quite late here in the UK now. The only thing I might have to do is close the room down and open it up again as public because um, we're not going to have very many people I think at the end of this one. Which would be a little bit of a shame but it's it'll also be a good thing as well. We can get a few more people in. Tom's 14 seconds down the road, well done my friend. Well done RL and Shumi and Lewis. The one, two and three again. But my oh, I don't think MJ likes this car. Um My congratulations go to GT Tom. I was pushing hard there and absolutely blitzed me. Absolutely blitzed me. Well Wow. We will have a look and see um, where people fell on that one. Um, RL9010 with the win and a 225.8. I actually quite enjoyed that. That's a good track for that car. Uh, Shumi in second with a 226.2. Lewis in third with a 227.7. And then Thugs in fourth, Welsh Boy in fifth, Malkovich in sixth, GT Tom with an awesome race in seventh. I got eighth, and Drak Fury was showboating in ninth. Okay, so your top three, RL9010, Shumi, and Lewis. Well done, well done, well done. Um, right, let's... Um, let is, oh, look, what I'm going to do is I am... Um, well, we've got 12 people still in the room at the moment. Do I want to go public yet? I think probably not. Uh, I'm just surprised we've still got this many people at this time. Uh, what is Glenn? Do you know what we could do? Oh, sausages. Let's go, just go long. And five laps. What the heck? What the heck? Let's just do it. Galacticor says, I know you, you're bigging me up to make me crash. I'm not, my friend, I'm not. I am genuinely loving the way that you're racing right now. I, I remember when you joined, and it's it's brilliant to see how you're racing now. I just love it. Dogs, last one for you. Oh, I didn't save the replay drag on that one. Yeah, if we if we continue to get like um, double figures, sort of ten or more, I'll stick to private room. Um, if we start getting lower, then I'll I'll drop into the other one. Then it is one o'clock at the moment, and I can't believe that we're still sitting this high. I love drift. Drac is so good at drifting. 
so so good at drifting I really really ought to hop out and um, change the oil in my car the trouble is there's no way of me doing it it's a real pain and uh, the problem my problem is that um, I don't really have another one to run. Um, but it's not that much higher, is it? Can I run this one? I think I'm going to run that car because my other one is just going to be cooked. The engine is going to be struggling. Because I've done so much racing in that car. So, 11 of us running. Oh, I've got a headache. I've got a big old headache. Guys, do you do you guys want to head out and change your oil and I'll set this up as a public room? Would you like to do that? You just give me a thumbs up if you'd like to change your oil and for me to set this up as public. Jack Fury say yeah, okay, I'm gonna do that. Um just give me a couple of seconds and I'll be back with a new room. Guys, go and change your oil, because we, we've done a lot of miles tonight. It's pointless, you know, cooking our engines. Um, it also gives me the opportunity to just do this for both of the cars. Uh, in fact, I can stay in the um, in my car, my livery car, then, which would be great, which would be nice. Uh, Drac is also telling me that I need to give it a wash. It's obviously looking a bit dirty. Uh, so we're doing oil change. Do a car wash. What else can we do to this little little monster? Can do an engine overhaul. Don't need that. Restore rigidity. Put a white body on it. If I put a white body on it, I'm going to mess up everything. So we won't do that. Uh, so done. An all change. I can stay in that car now tonight. Should we see what ticket I've got? Just while everybody's sorting the cars out. You know it's going to be brilliant, don't you? It's going to be a great prize. 20 million credits coming up. You watch. Oh, there's a, there's a nice looking car in there. I don't need the parts. Oh, I'll get the lowest number of coins. How did you know? How did you know? I'm so surprised. I'm gutted. Oh, King Weirdo, you didn't wipe body it. Buy a new body for it. Wow, Shimmy's just won a half million rough engine. Uh, King, go and go and take that white body off it. Stick another, stick a new body shell on it. That's what I would do. Got to do it. I had to do that with one of my other cars. Take the uh, the wide body off it, put a new body shell in it. I think it worked. Can't remember now. Uh, if not, have you got the Cosworth King? You got the Sierra Cosworth? A couple of the guys have been running Cosworths. Uh, good night, thugs. Thank you for racing this evening. Been really, really, really brilliant. Really appreciate it. If you haven't already, please smack the like button on the way out. That would really make my day. Um, so load settings, randomizer races uh, on this one. 
where are we heading off to? I can't even remember where we're going. Oh, Watkins. Watkins, 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 Watkins. Um, I'll just do this one at five laps. Custom weather, that would do. Yeah, whatever, whatever, whatever. Make it public. I think we're all good. Now, obviously, guys, on this one now, we will get people running different cars and elbows out. So just be warned, it's not likely to be super respectful. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I've got no clue why I've got to keep doing that. Some of you might be struggling to get your cars in. I've just got to take the PP limit up a little bit. But I can't for the moment. Because we've got people are um, initialising. Just waiting for Ali. Uh, we've already got a few new people joining us. That was quick. going to be interesting to see what sort of cars come in now oh game of dan's got a cool livery uh, so we are going to get a few different cars coming in Okay, qualifier at. Um, I've gone a bit quiet because I've gone really tired all of a sudden. Sorry, guys. Um, I've suddenly gone very, very, very quiet. I'm very tired, I mean. Uh, it's just. Mind you, I was up at three o'clock this morning to drop the guys at the airport. Um, so we're going to start this at 10 past. But at the moment, I'm just having a little bit of a chill. Um, I 
Uh, good evening, Toby. Good evening to everybody that I haven't said good evening to thus far. Uh, we're up to 13 in the room, so quite uh, quite a significant number. It looks like I, we did lose Ali. Um, but we are also going to get people that are not going to be running the um, the appropriate car. But it's just something we're going to have to deal with, guys. The PP is on, so it should level things out a little bit. And we'll go running at, um, at 10 past. In the meantime, I am getting... Oh, Heckish. I'm going to have another wagon wheel. We like wagon wheels. This video is sponsored by Wagon Wheel. No, it's not. <laughs> I can wish, but it's not. Oh, the blue ones with the jam. I like the red ones, the originals. The only thing is... Don't talk where you're eating. Either I've turned into a giant, or these are a fraction of the size that they were when I was a kid. Annoyingly, I think they've got smaller. There you go, Ashley. They are. How smaller now? It's like Mars bars. I remember when Mars bar was a big old chunk of chocolate in your hand. Trouble is, they've all got to the point where they can't put the prices up anymore because they're at that sweet spot where people won't pay extra. So all they can do is make them smaller. So I guess over time, a regular Mars bar is going to be the size of a Creations Mars bar before much longer. I like Mars bars too. Okay, here's a question. You know I'm going to ask. You know what question I'm going to ask you now. How many of you, I've got chocolate everywhere, how many of you eat the toffee off the, um, the, the nougari bit on a Mars bar, go along it, taking the toffee bit off? Yeah. Right, racer, Eli racer, why are you not in a car, my friend? Why are we not in a car? I am going to get this going. I'm waiting on Technic and Frederico. M Tech, are you running with us? Okay, I've got M Tech M. Yeah, we're ready to race, Eli, as soon as you grab a car. You need to grab a car, mate. As soon as you grab your car, we're off. I am going to start this in a moment, whether people are ready or not. What is Eli Racer doing? 
I can't keep waiting. Toby, I'm going to in a moment. I, I don't know. I've been waiting for a liar. Racer. Okay, we're in. Okay. All right, no problem. Not a problem. I've got chocolate everywhere, all over my chair. I have to sort that out tomorrow. Don't eat chocolate when you're driving in a nice rig with a nice chair. Don't do it. It's not good. Roman Kung needs to uh, sort his tyres out. He's on hards. That's never going to work out well. God, this is unknown. Where on earth do I break into this corner? Most of the other guys have all been practicing while I've been sitting sorting stuff out. I'm going to let this car through. What, no need to brake through the bus stop? Bit. Really? No, surely you got a brake there. I'll have to get that a try. Oh, where have I got the track limit? That's what you call using all the track and a little bit more. <laughs> I was enjoying uh, Game of Dan's showboating and I forgot all about where to break. <laughs> it's the only trouble with Friday nights is I enjoy all of you driving and I forget to rate I forget to drive myself sometimes. Whoa, you can't go through there without braking. You cannot go through there without braking. No way. Somebody's having my having me on. Somebody's pulling my leg. Oh thank you, Gamer Dan, you just straightened me up. I was going around. <laughs> you straightened me up. Happy days, happy days. Oh, look at this synchronized sliding up front. Who's that? Game with Dan and Malkovich, both synchronized sliding. Love it.
Oh, that was a good save. My lap time is always depressing. Look, you got Shumi with a 2083, and you think, oh, if I can get a 210, that'll be good. And I come in with a 220. What? How can you be that slow? No, let me rephrase that. How could Shumi be that fast? <laughs> That's because he's not braking through here. I can't, I cannot go through that flat. There's no way. No, 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 no way. Not, not, no, 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 just no. Toby, I think you need to come out here and show us how to do that. I think I've just been Tobied. And yes, that's a technical term. Right, here we go. Who have we got in this one? We got myself, Gamer Dan, Ray Monkun, Technic, Tom, as in GT Tom, Malkovich, Eli Racer, Ashley Lewis, RO9010, Welsh Boy, Shumi, and Faz. So the only new person we've really got in there is uh, Ra Raymon. I'm going to call him Raymon. That's easiest to do. Um, Otherwise, we're all friends. Um, at 12 out of 16 at this time of night. Really? Woo. I can't believe I've been streaming since, well, I started this at six o'clock, but obviously it took me half an hour of shenanigans with the technology. Uh, so around about half past six, we started this. I can't believe I'm still racing. Uh, I think I've probably only got this one and maybe one more in me, so um, I'm not quite sure where we're going to go next because I've run out of what's it's on my bit paper. But um, have a think about it, guys. We'll do a vote for the next one. Which, knowing you guys, is going to be another one at the Nords. Which, to be honest, I wouldn't mind. Uh, not early enough. Sorry, Malkovich, I was trying to get out of Ashley's way and then I was trying to get out of your way and, oh, that was a bit difficult.
that bus stop's got the better of me. see what we can do here with the bus stop on this lap go everybody's breaking for it right I'll be back racing with GT in a moment because I'm going to pick up a penalty so I'm not going to worry too much oh, about being where I am but he's going to be right on my back bumper now anyway Where's he gone? Is that commentator's curse again? Uh, wait about three years. Where's Tom? Is he still circulating? Yes, he is. Where is he? I want to see a few more of those stars. We're up to four stars now. I've just got to earn my fifth star and then I'll be happy. But for the moment, it seems we're only worthy of four. I've got to work out what I've got to do to get that fifth star from GT Tom. Whoa! I'm off, GT's off. My dear, he must get a massive penalty for that. No, only half! The same as me! How did it happen?
All right, here we go. Here we go. Don't go out too wide. Oh, he got a tank slapper on. Well held. I thought that was going around. I thought that was my opportunity to strike. Alas, it did not happen. Careful not to get in too deep, Mitchell, and get a tap on the way through. Flash the old lights. See if I can intimidate him. No, I don't want to do that. Well, I'll flash the lights, but I won't do that anymore. Oh, right on the back. Tell you what, we're catching uh, Widow. Oh, Mitchell. Come on, we can't let him beat you again. Control trying to just get up the inside there. Oh no, got a half second again. Come on, we can't lose this again. Oh no, it's going to be a full second at the end. No. T's going to be me again. I think I've gone too wide on that one while I'm pushing as well. Yeah, up one and a half now. Oh, he's got the better of me again. And I haven't even spent loads of time jibber jabbering this one. I've actually been trying. Two seconds now, just pushing as hard as I can, and wow! <laughs> GT, well done, well done, well done, well done. Oh dear! Oh, where are we? Where are we? Result. Uh, Game of Dan won that one with a 208.4. Uh, Lewis right up there again all night long with a 2093. Shumi in third with a 2079 out of fastest laps. Well done. Welsh Boy in fourth. Malkovic in fifth. Oro 9010 in sixth. MTech in seventh. Faz in eighth. Ally Racer in ninth. Gigi Tom in tenth. I tried and tried and tried but couldn't catch him. I got 11th. And Raymon was a DNF in that one. I think he uh, gave up. So your top three, Game of Dan, A. Lewis and Shumi. Guys, 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 guys. Where are we heading off for the last race of the evening? Um, because I, yeah. Good night, Matt. Thank you ever so much, mate, for racing with us this evening. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. I am actually getting completely shattered now. Um, who wants to pick out a really good track? I actually quite fancy... Oh, 9010's gone spa. I was thinking Red Bull. Oh, Monza. Oh, we got some good tracks coming out. Oh... We have got. 
Oh, I tell you where we haven't where we haven't gone tonight. It's an old favourite. How about Michelin Raceway Road, Atlanta? What about Michelin? It's an old favourite. Good night, Matt. Good night, good night, good night. Aro ninety cent says sure. I think that's I think that's a good shout. I think I'm going to pull rank. Match your West End with that hairpin. I'm going to pull rank, I'm afraid, guys. We, This is a track that we all like. It's quite technical. It's short. It's a good one. It's a good one. <laughs> Barcelona. Have we not had enough of Barcelona? We've got to do... do we got to do... we got to do, do... I can't even talk now. We've got to do... San Croix. B, I think it is. We've all got to learn that track now for next Friday. Is it next Friday we're racing? I don't even know when we're, we're racing the next one, you know, guys. Uh, but we're going to have to get, we're going to have to run that this week to get ourselves sorted with our strategy, with everything, because we're all doing really well. Uh, Ashley Lewis, please not Barcelona. Um, oh, dear. It's the 19th. So that is going to be this Friday, next Friday. Well, there's a short version of Barcelona in the weeklies. Okay. Cool beans. I've got to do the weeklies. I'm going to do them tomorrow. Probably going to do a short video on that because several people have asked me, um, do I do the weeklies? Why do I do them if I've always done the, if I've done all of the, the world circuit races? And um, I am going to answer that question. Um, it's a very simple answer. Um, and, uh, yeah, we will be, uh, we'll be tackling that one. Assuming, well, yeah, should be tomorrow that I do that. Whether I do that on the stream or not, I don't know. I might do it on the stream, I might record it. And the other thing I'm doing tomorrow, guys, during the day, is, um... I'm going to try the daily races tomorrow. Probably be daily race B, but I am going to try the daily races just to see what we can do with regards to the, um, the DR. Uh, so at the moment, we're sitting pretty much... If I can find it. Can't get to it. No, you can't. Uh, pretty much in the middle of the B, and my SRS rating is very, very, very low. Um, so I had some really bad races the last time I was running this. Um, I did... For full disclosure, I did do a couple of daily races the other uh, the other night. Uh, the night that we I shut the stream down early, I headed off and did a couple. The first one I got punted off and went round span on the first corner, but then I finished two places higher than I started. I was sort of around about tenth, I think I was starting. In the second race, there was a load of A and A plus rated races. And I finished four places ahead of where I started, which I was really pleased with. Um, Ashley, I might not pop in tomorrow. going to throw my own stream up tomorrow. That's not a problem, mate, because I don't normally stream at the weekend. Uh, so I won't be doing lobbies tomorrow night. If I do any streaming, it's probably going to be streaming the dailies. And if the dailies are awful and I'm getting fed up with them and going backwards, then I'm going to be heading into other people's lobbies and supporting them. So, um, Ashley, I may well even see you. Um, King, have you got the Cosy? Have you got the, the Cosworth? Ah, okay. I mean, I'm happy enough for you to grab something that, that fits. I mean, just have a look and see what's in your garage that works. Just come and race with us. Come and race. I don't care what you're in. We're that time of night. I really don't care. Let's just race. Let's just have some fun. Uh, Ashley says, if you stream, I'll jump in and throw a like. Oh, thank you. Assuming that's aimed at me. <laughs> there's, there's plenty of other people that will be streaming tomorrow. Ashley, the game will force him to do that anyway. 
Um, so I'm saying just go through your garage and pick something. It's just I know you've been waiting all night and I know you're in um, Australia, the other side of the world. So it's not often we get to race together. So it's, it's nice. Just just come and race with us. Yay. Good, good. Uh, I don't know what Steph's doing. Oh, Steph's going in with the Cosworth. Cool. We're just having fun today. This isn't about winning. It's in, it's just enjoying these cars. And I've thoroughly enjoyed this little BMW. It's been an absolute dream to race this evening. I've loved it. The way it handles and everything. It's just so nice. Um, are we on racing softs, are we? No, sports softs we're on. What does the uh, thing he say, the event? Uh, it should say sports soft. Yeah, sports, whatever sports tyres you want. Yeah, we've got two Labatt's Cozzies. <laughs> that doesn't matter, it's fine. I just get confused as to who's driving which one. Um, Elias in, we're all in. You know what? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Rock on, guys. Let's let's enjoy this one. Um, who we got to beat? Well, we got to beat Team the Bats, haven't we? They're running together. I think we need to beat them. Fair and square. No bumping, no grinding, no bashing, no crashing. Keep it clean. Have fun. That's what we're all about. Good luck, everybody. Oh, shall we? I'm rewarded. I am very tired. I've gone very, very tired all of a sudden. Says the man that did 28 hours. Great. What a wimp. What a wimp. Right, Mitchell, it's only an outlap. You're not racing. What are you doing? It's only an outlap. And I'm racing, you're getting track limit penalties. <laughs> if I keep yawning enough, I'm gonna make all of you yawn. <laughs> yeah, we'll all be yawning together. We'll yawn in unison. There'll be a collective yawn as we go across the line. <laughs> Ashley, you is just Lord. <laughs> he yawned as well. Yes. <laughs> it's catching. I do that at conference, you know, when I get bored and I'm at conference. I'll deliberately yawn and then I watch the yawn go around the room. It just pleases my little chaotic mind. Little things please little minds. <laughs> so I'm glad it's doing now. Come on in. Who else is yawning? Hands up. Own up. <laughs> oh my word. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh crikey. Here we go again. Oh, MTech really doesn't like the penalties. These are the penalties that we always run, my friend. They're like become a staple of my lobbies. Well, I say my lobbies of our community. These are the settings that we all are pretty much signed up to and enjoy. It's only really, I think, the track limit one that's on maybe the um pet one but we're not going to be petting so that won't matter
I hope you guys have enjoyed the uh, stream this evening. I am privileged to have had so many great people racing with us tonight. And it looks like the chat has been nice and respectful and a nice place to be. So thank you to everybody for that as well. And we'll be back. Uh, well, as I said, I'll be back tomorrow at some point doing some bits and pieces. But we'll be back with the lobbies on Monday. And I'm still quite not quite sure whether to do a themed night every night or whether to do a collective every night. By that I mean Monday we do the daily races for those people that want to practice daily races against real people. Tuesday fully randomised races where we don't know what combinations we're going to get. Wednesday our favourite races. Thursday a combination of favourite and um, random, pure random. And then Friday into a whoa, Friday into a spin I think. Uh, Friday back into doing what we're doing today where we do a special um, or whether our evenings are made up of one or two pure random races followed by a series of favourite races uh, on both days I'm planning on finishing up with Nordschleifer and occasionally we might start with a Nordschleifer for those people that aren't staying with us all night I'm still undecided which to run with for those of you that are around and listening and that are, uh, are in the Discord, please let me know your thoughts on what you would prefer or even in the chat right now if you want. Um, if you want to give me an answer to that question, then please just put at PlayStation Racer at the beginning of your little chat comment so that it jumps out at me. But I'm still undecided. I did do a poll on it and the poll went 50-50 which is pretty typical for around here. MTech, you want to do the Nürburgring Grand Prix circuit? Do I want to do one more? I'm pretty chat, I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty tired. I'm, well, I might do, I might do one more. I might do one more. One more would be an encore, wouldn't it? Be like singing a song. Just one. Oh no, I nearly went then. Well, you know where I nearly went then, didn't I? Oh, that was the opening to just one cornetto. Give it to me. Delicious ice cream from Italy. Except it doesn't come from Italy, so the whole advert was a complete lie. <laughs> you can't buy Cornettos in Italy. And the ice cream doesn't come from Italy. Ashley Lewis is multitasking, racing, watching the stream, and Drift Matsuri. And racing. Well. Well done, my friend. <laughs> That's quite a list of things to be doing all at the same time. Wow. Um, I struggle to stream and race. I struggle to do two things. <laughs> Focus is everywhere. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Um, right, here we go. So, um, yeah, the big question is whether we do the, the Nürburgring GP after this one. We've still got quite a few people. But it is coming up to two o'clock in the morning. And I've got things to do in the morning. But this is just so much fun. I find this so relaxing. It's better than sleeping, this. If I could do this instead of sleep, that's what I would do. Whoa, is a car coming across the track? How on earth did I manage to miss that one? Mr. Cosy, you've got to give me some room, mate. <laughs> Who was that? Oh, it's Team Labatt's. Oh, it had to be, didn't it? Like, I've got a track limit now thing because I know nowhere to go. 
I just give him a nudge on the way through to say, Oi, come on. you got to give me some room. Thank you for the place back. I don't care. We're having fun on Friday. I really don't care. This is just too much fun. God, look at this. 0 0.5, 0 0.5, 0 0.5. <laughs> Did we all follow each other off or something? Oh, certainly my focus isn't everywhere. Look, I'm getting penalties. I need to take a leaf out of Ashley's book. Oh, I've got a car on the inside. Oh, got a proper chap through there. <laughs> and I got a nice tap from RL. See, RL gives me a nice tap. Okay, right. Who was that? Was that Steph? Are we going elbows out? I think we are. I think we're going elbows out. Here we go, British touring car style. We'll lose a few mirrors, we'll lose a few bumpers. Okay, there goes a the bumper. Let's rub the bumper. I'm going to break all my own rules now, guys. I'm sorry. All my rules are going out the window. Oh, look, I've frightened him off the road. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't laugh. Oh, I shouldn't laugh. That's not very respectful, is it? That's not very respectful at all. But it is Friday and anything goes on a Friday. And look look who we're on. I think Tom needs a bit of a help here. Thank you for the nudge. Come on, give me a nudge. Yes, I got a nudge on Tom. Hopefully that's helped him a little bit. A. Lewis is saying shush. I'm sorry, mate, but that's never going to happen. Not on my lobbies. Oh. Go on, racer. you got a modern day car. Get shifting. Beautiful, this car. It's just amazing. Oh, no, no, not so much that time. Not so much that time. Right, got a car coming through, another one coming through. Let them, let those two guys go, and then we'll get back on it. Oh, great. RL and Welsh boy thinking, oh, God, there goes Mitchell. He's done it again. I'll tell you who's done it again, it's GG Tom. Every time I look in my rear view mirror, I see GG Tom going this way and that way. But I'll tell you what, he always controls it. It's just amazing. The trouble is, when I'm behind him and I'm chasing him, he's like putting it away all the time and I can't keep up. So right now, I'm going to try and win. We're going to try and win. Focus. Channel the inner Jedi. Build a force. Whoa. I can feel the force surging through me. Either that or it's adrenaline. Come on! Chasing down Welsh boy here. Oh, I scared him off the track too, look. <laughs> they can't cope with me coming up behind them. It's like, no, Morgan's coming up behind us. Let's jump off the track, otherwise he's going to hit us and run us off. He's a hooligan, he's a lunatic, he's an absolute maniac. Get out the way! Whoa! 
it's, there's an example of lunatic Morgan. Oh no, Welsh boy's going to come back through now. Oh, I've done all that hard work. No. Don't go on the grass, don't go on the grass. Come on. We need that place back. Come on. Come to me. Somebody's gone happy with their um, little car horns. Oh, really pushing the limits now. Yeah, pushing them a bit too hard. Just trying to catch up with Welsh boy. He's just too quick. He's just too quick. Oh, why did I change down gear? Oh, now I've got a problem. Now I've got a big problem. Whoa, going round again. Oh, no, I've got a huge problem now. No, GT Tom's just gone through. No, 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 no. Oh, I've blown it. No. I've blown it massive. Let's have a race with Steph because GT Tom's gone. Here we go. The second half of Team Labatt's. They've clearly fallen out of each other because they're not helping each other. Oh, no. He's got a run on me. Oh, and I've got the penalty. I forgot about that. Oh, you numpty. I'm going to have to be super quick through the chicane at the bottom. It really hurts that penalty there. Can we close up? Can we close up? Can we close up if we go over the top? The yellow flag's flying, but I know why, because people... No, we can't get him. Oh, complete loss. No. Oh, no. No, we can't leave it like that, can we? We need to do one more, methinks. We need to do one more. You can tell I got tired, I've gone stupid. All right, here we go. Here we go, right, who, who the... Actually, was first with 136.5. Gamer Dan with the fastest lap of 135.7. Shumi in third with a 136.5. And then we got IRL 90.10. Welsh boy, Faz. I'm not mentioning that name in seventh because he's just made a fool of me yet again. It was GT Tom again. Beating me. Not happy. Not happy. Eli Racer in eighth. Steph in ninth. I got 10th, and Technic, unfortunately, was a, a DNF in that one. Okay, I, well, I've got I've got to get GT Tom. It's got to happen. It's got to happen. So we'll head off to the Nürburgring GP. And um, my last chance. My last chance. GT, if I was you, I would call it a day because I'm coming to get you this time the gloves are off the gloves are off I'm probably about 8 nil at the moment I've got to get one got to get one I think everybody should be in either the Cosworth or the BMW except GT Tom who should be a Fiat 500 what say you 
RL, done. Done. Done, done, done. Right, so my tactics... Well, we're just going into the race, so the game's going to decide the order. So, um, my tactics in this one is... Um, don't tell anybody, but I'm going to try catch up with Tom and I'm going to run him off the road. I'm going to put him into the barrier so hard he's going to the Shadow Realm and then I might actually win. I might actually win. We'll have to see. Ashley, it's a good car, isn't it? He's actually said in the chat, I really like this car stock. It's brilliant. I'll, where, what we do, I mean, I know you're new around here. We, Friday night, and in fact, all of the races that we do, we run stock cars for close racing. Um, and it makes for some brilliant racing. And we come across some real gems. This is one of them. We come across some real gems from time to time. And um, I've just loved this evening. It's been a massive surprise to me um, how good this car has been. Uh, and I also have, I don't know if you know, I have a randomizer that we run during the week. Uh, I've got a 205, that's when we'll go. Um, yeah, I've got a randomizer and it, it randomizes stuff up. And um, some of these BMW races are going to go in there. Um, I've already got, um, where do I have written down? Somewhere. Um, oh yeah, San Kwa B. Uh, I'm going to do. Suzuka I enjoy, but it's a bit long. I think this one will probably be going in there. Um, Technic. All specs. All specs off. I don't know what you mean by specs. All specs on. All settings on. What you want to, um, you want to, you want to. We've got a lot of them on. I mean, suspension's on. I can turn the others on if you want. I don't care. I never play around with mine because I always mess them up. Done. Ah, uh, done. Done, done, done. Yeah, actually, it's a wicked little car. The Cosworth is good as well. The Cosworth is a really good car. Actually, what, what, are you running the Cosworth or are you running the... The Beamer. I think you're running the Cozzy, aren't you? Can't remember what you're running now. I should know. Yeah, you're running... The Cozzy is brilliant. I've got... Well, I did have 10 of them. I've sold a few. Um, and annoyingly, I had the opportunity um, to buy one of them for real back in the day. Um, and I used to drive one. Uh, our chairman, where, where I used to work, had one. And there was only three of us that could, could drive. It was the chairman, the managing director, and me. And um, I used to love it. Brilliant. Really good. Um, fabulous, fabulous, fabulous car. Uh, and I actually want to do, the next time the Cosworth comes up in the used car dealership, I'm going to do an evening of the Cosworth. Pure Cosworth, all night long. I had the... Uh, the you want about the, um, the Sapphire Cosworth? Because I've driven the Sierra Cosworth, the original one, the Sapphire Cosworth, and I've also... No, I didn't get an, an RS500. It was just the two. The normal Cosy and the... Did I get to drive a 500? Did Diggy have a 500? 
don't think he did. Oh, I'm getting tired. Um, but yeah, I did the Sapphire. For those of you that don't know, the Sierra Cosworth is the one that's in the game. The Sapphire Cosworth was the Sierra with the boot, not the hatchback. That was the Sapphire. Uh, both great, great, great cars. I think I preferred the Sierra Cosworth because it had the whale tail, whereas the Sapphire didn't. The Sapphire had a sort of regular spoiler on it. Uh, although my boss, the um, service director at the time, had the um, two litre, was it a two litre S, I think? I think it had a two litre S. That was a stonking car, I tell you. Uh, that was a Sapphire. Uh, brilliant. Absolutely great. I am an old Fords man, I'm afraid. I loved Fords when I was a kid. And um, I used to work for a Ford dealership uh, for the longest time. Orbalate is in the room. Hey, hey, good evening, Orb. Good evening, good evening, good evening. I'm just, I am going to wait for Orb to grab a car. Uh, no apologies for waiting. I, like, I love Orb. He's, he's a diamond guy. Um, again, Orbalator used to be one of those guys, I hope he won't mind me saying so, that was quite slow when he came to us. He was learning, he was new to everything. Now, he's quick. He's learnt a heck of a lot in a short period of time. And um, I'm going to struggle to stay with him too. I love that. I love seeing people getting quicker and quicker and quicker. And I'm hoping he's going to race with us. Only trouble is I don't know if he's got the if he's got the Beamer. That's that's the only thing. He might not have the Beamer, the the BMW. I love it. Um, um, oh dear. GT, I, I hope, I hope that you, you're joking and jesting because I love, I'm loving the way that you are driving at the moment. I am adoring it. Um, I love to see people improving. I absolutely adore that. And I'm not, I'm not trying to be silly. Um, I am really pleased to um, be going up against you and struggling. Um, I, I'm pretty sure it was you. I think Orb used to as well. Would there was a big car coming up and it, you put over out of the way? Right uh, now, it's just going for it, and it's it's brilliant. I love it. I really, really do. Cool. Absent ride here. Better be quick. You better be quick. But yes, there is room. There is room at the moment. Ah, game it down. Yeah, I know. Um, Oh, thank you, Gamer Dan. It's been brilliant. I'm glad we got you back in. I'm really glad because, uh, again, I've been watching you racing. I've been watching a lot of different people racing tonight, and it's been brilliant. Uh, we had some issues earlier in the week. So part of my role tonight has been to watch a lot of what's going on in the room. And, again, I've had one or two people in the chat that have been watching as well. And uh, I've already seen a few uh, things and on the whole the racing seems to have been pretty good again it's been really great really great thank you ride 
appreciate like it's very confusing with two different names um or oh, are you running are you racing or are you just spectating have you got something quote close Or if you've got something close, then go with it. If you got, have you got the Cosworth? Or just grab anything, anything that you've got that fits the criteria. All right, no worries. That's fine. That's cool. I'll let you call out and tell me who's behaving and who's not. Here we go guys, we're off and up and running. We're up and running. All Belater is officially Chief Steward for this one. And I have slipped in bribes. So I'm I'm good, I'm fine. Yeah, he won't he won't uh, he won't pick me up on anything. Because I'm all good. See we we're, we're like that with buddies. Oh you're welcome, mate. Right, here we go. Keep it respectful, guys. If you do bump somebody, just give the place back by way of an apology and then just explain in the chat what happened and we'll all remain friends. Otherwise, have a really great night. Enjoy this one. It's the last one of the night. And uh, just have fun as we've had all night long. I can't believe I've been racing since half past six. And I can't believe I'm still top of the... The tables in the uh, in the STCC, except I've gone in there really too deep. Oh, just about got away with that. I can't believe we're still heading the tables. I, I need to check that out. I still think the guys are winding me up. I mean, I think they were sincere in what they were saying. And if I am, then that is just way beyond my wildest expectations. It really is. Gamer Dan gets minus 10 for not washing his car. Good man. Is that minus 10 seconds or minus 10 minutes? Because it is Gamer Dan we're talking about. I'm probably going to need 10 minutes. 10 seconds is probably not going to be enough. Whoa! Whoa, dear, that was not... Sorry. Whoever that was, I just clobbered. That was Kaywa, sorry. Hello, Richard. Oh, I'm getting in everybody's way in this one. Faz is off. Ashley and Faz, I think, have just had a bit of a, a bit of argy bargy. One of them has stopped. Thank you. Oh, Richard's Richard's um trying to tempt me with one more. Richard, if we do, what do you want to race? Oh, I don't want you to get you in trouble, mate. The last thing I want to do is get somebody in trouble with their partner. That's not a good idea. Oh. That was a uh, dive bomb if ever I saw it. Let's let GT back. That was not fair. That was a dive bomb and a half. GT, well done for missing me. How on earth you managed to miss me, I don't know. Okay, Richard, what, what are we racing in? You pick a track. Uh, we're racing the BMW... M3 <laughs> GT and I have just done the same thing <laughs> Oh my god Where is he? I'm going to have to wait We've <laughs> That was synchronised spinning Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Is he? I can't see him for the moment There he is He spun and I spun in exactly the same way, exactly the same place. 
Largo Maggio short. That's not the corkscrew, is it? You picked a track I'm not very good at. Oh, have I got in front of him? No, he's still there. Oh, I thought I got him. Quick look at the radar. I thought, yes, we've done it. And then he snuck through on the inside. Come on, we got just a couple more laps. Whoa. I just caught the back of him. No, that's put me off the back. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. I'm gonna have to catch him now. I cannot go down again. Oh, or you don't know what you're missing, my friend. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, 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 don't go around. No, get off the grass. Come on. What are you doing? You're trying to make your life hard. What? He's on the crazy con. <laughs> oh my god. Richard, I'm, I'm happy to do large, Largo, Largo, whatever it is. Maggio, blah, blah. Go with your first choice. Whoa! Did GT Tom get mixed up in that accident? I think he might have done, didn't he? So let, let, let's just um, let's just close up again because I don't want to. I want a fair fight. I want a fair fight. Come on! Let's just knock some cones out of the way. Got to give the marshals something to do, and I. I've not bothered the marshals all night. Normally I do. Normally I get into terrible arguments with the marshals. Uh, apparently, according to RL9010, one time I think it was RL9010 anyway, um, or was it Rimac? I can't remember. They were waiting for me at the end of the um, at the end of the pit lane with pitchforks, waiting to take me down because I've made such a mess. Um, we were at Grand Valley, and I was rearranging all of the uh, cones and throwing up mud all over the place. Ugh. Yeah, mud everywhere, cones everywhere. Apparently they were getting really angry. I tried bribing them, but it didn't work. And then I said I'd take them all to the pub afterwards. That didn't work. I had to sneak out the back of the uh, the pit, the garage, climbed in the back of a car, and then they, uh, the team manager snuck me out. Otherwise, I think I was going to be lynched, complete lynch mob at the back uh, back of the paddock. Crazy, crazy, crazy. And I've still got the paramedic rings me up occasionally, moaning about my driving in the ambulance that time, and the fact that. Um, she blames me that the patient succumbed on the way because of my driving. God, then we had the night where um, I had the stormtroopers after me. It all happens here. It all happens. Right. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. got to catch him he's not going to get another one I'm gonna start flashing my light time I think full-blown intimidation the trouble is he's so far away you won't even see Oh, Red Bull Ring. That's a good shout. I fancy Red Bull Ring. I think these could be quite good around Red Bull Ring too. Come on, Mitchell. Close up.
Oh, I'm doing what I can for you. I'm trying. The trouble is, GC Tom's just too good. Oh, look. Penalty again. As soon as I get close, I get a penalty. I'm having to push so hard to catch him. So now we've got to serve this penalty and then catch up again. Or can I get in front? Oh, it's on the gravel. I'm still being told to turn the penalties off. Oh, I can't watch the chat and catch oh, GT. Come on. Got one lap to catch him. Come on. He's four seconds down the road. Right, game on, come on. driving I'm trying I'm trying I'm trying but I'm just not good enough Five point four down the road. He's just making me look silly right now. This is a not the fair. Mitchell Morgan must drive hard, faster, harder, better. We put it in the gravel now. Uh, we've got RL9010 and Gamer Dan up there. Right up there at the top again. With uh, our new runner. Which. Oi, 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 oi. Right. Woo! What were our winners so arrow 9010 was our winner with a 2210 gamer dan in second with a 2210 as well look how close that was for the fastest lap but gamer dan dropped it so rl 9010 goes top 
and Gamer Dan gets fastest slaps. That's nice up there, isn't it? Uh, Era was, uh, assuming I'm saying that correctly, is third. Welsh Boy fourth. Shumi fifth. Lewis sixth. Baz seventh. GT Tom eighth. I got ninth. And Technic and Kawa were DNFs. RL9010 top. Gamer Dan second with the fastest lap. And Era 13. So I think RL9010 need to pull it out of the bag and get the fastest lap and the win next time. Gamer Dan, you need to pull it out of the bag and get a win. No pressure. No pressure. No pressure whatsoever. Right. Uh, we're going off to the Red Bull ring for this one. And we're just going to go straight into the race. So pretty much as soon as the cars are lined up. Um, then here we go. Oh, guys, if you're enjoying this tonight, give me a give me a double thumbs up. I, I am enjoying this. It'd be nice to know that you are, too. I think it, I think we are because so many people are still racing. Oh, so many of us. Well, I'm not because my two young ladies are in Barcelona this weekend. So I'm all home alone uh, with with Coda. Um, so I'll be fine. But I hope that some of you guys are not going to get in trouble for being up racing this late in the morning. Um, I can't believe that it's I don't even want to where's the time it's half past two and we're still racing anybody I think I was back on another community uh, charity gig uh, <laughs> but there we go there we go um, so I think Richard is uh, uh, Mako Meso Meso I don't know how to pronounce that again hey, you guys got such weird names I need easy names like Bob, Bill, Sue, Jenny, Joanna, Lauren, Ellie. I can cope with all those names. They should be, right? They should be stock. They should be stock. They definitely should be stock cars. Um, I don't know if you've got the um, the a little BMW. If you have, great. If not, grab the Cosworth. If you haven't got either of those, just grab something that's close. Rod, Jane and Freddy. Now, Freddy's got too many syllables. That's a fr e d d e. I can't cope with that. It's too long. Fred? I'll cope with Fred. Freddy's just... Oh, wow, it's a bit too long. That's why I like, you know, Bill, Bob and Sue. They work. And then I suppose I've gone for a name Mitchell Morgan. I mean, how crazy is that? Five oh two PP should be fine. Right, yeah, no problem. Go and try the Ford. The Ford is great. The Cosy is brilliant. I do want to do another one of these Fridays in the Cosworth because it is a blindingly good car. Just keep it stock. Keep them stock. Yeah, Maceo's in the um is in the what's it? Yeah, all belated joined us. Whoop whoop. Yeah. Hey. Oh, it was still worth doing one last one. Right here. Oh, somebody just snuck in right at the last minute there. Yunan. Yeah, because he's a great car. Brilliant car. I am going to do a one-nighter in that. Uh, we've got the um, Mitsubishi versus the Subaru next weekend, next Friday. After that, um, we're pretty open. And I'll either go Cozzy or we'll do the BMW VGT. But also some of the other guys in the community are uh, hosting some events. So we could be a gamer night in there. I'm not quite sure yet um, when Drac has set his games up for. I've got a funny feeling one of them might be next Friday. I'm not quite sure. 
Uh, Steve Jackson, Clubman Cup Plus Special Stage Route X tip, please. First time watching your stream. Keep. Uh, is that for the um, the World Circuit race that you're asking the tip for? As in one of the one of the challenges in the game. If it is, I've got all of those on my channel. Just look it up. If you Google it, you'll find it. Most of my hits on my channel now come from Google. People looking it up. Uh, Beso, grab a car. Grab a car, please. And then we're going to go. Okay, now so it's done. Uh, UNN doesn't seem to be doing too much at the moment. Yeah. Pop up on my stream, do a search for it, you'll find it. Uh, I can't remember if I did it on normal or hard. Most of them I'm doing on hard now. Um, I'm pretty sure with that race, it was all down to the car that I chose. And annoyingly, I, I, I gave up on that when I struggled with it. And I googled around and I bought two cars with engine swaps and stuff. And they didn't do the trick and then I jumped in the car that I did it in and it was easy and then it's just it's slipstreaming it's all about the slipstreaming and knowing when to pull out and go I'm going to get this one underway guys I'm not waking, waiting for um, this other person anymore um, I'm going to get going uh, but I, I should have a video on it if you search my channel And I go through the car I choose, the setup, the strategy. I go through everything and then I run the race, which a lot of people don't. I just do the setups and stuff. I do the whole race so you can see exactly what I did. And I started off doing them all on hard. And then some people were saying to me it was too difficult to do them on normal. So I dropped back to doing them on normal for a while. Um, and then um, then we, we then, I, then I've gone back to hard. Uh, slipstream is key. Don't bump draft them. If you bump draft the AI, they move out of the way. It doesn't work. So just slipstream them. Sorry, Ride, I didn't pick where people started. It was all just in whatever order. Whatever order the game wanted. Yeah, we're still going, Bugs. Where is, um... Right, he's here. Right, let's see what you're made of. Let's see what you're made of. Have we got a problem with that car, Paz? Yeah, I love the Cosworth. I've decided we're definitely doing an evening like this in the Cosworth very 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 soon
Ooh, that could be a penalty. It is. <laughs> oh, why am I celebrating somebody else's misfortune? Do you know what, Boggs? I was just thinking the same. But I wasn't going to say anything. I didn't want to be uh, too forward. <laughs> That's why I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing his name correctly. He's just got a monstrous run down there. Really gone away from me. He must have got a brilliant run out of that corner. Error. Okay. I'm really throwing this little beam around and I can't get close to him we're letting in too many good drivers guys this isn't fair everybody's starting to make me look stupid I think we need a um, we need a uh, some sort of interview and if you're too good you're not allowed to join I think that's what we need now And no, I'm not being sensible and serious. I am joking. I'm loving it. We're, we're getting some really good, clean races. Let's just see how good he is at overtaking. He's up against Welsh Boy. Now, if I know Welsh Boy, he's not going to make it easy. Can I just stay close enough to see how things go? Oh, he's gone down the inside. Whoa, I'm going round. Uh. Oh, bend it. So I won't get to watch now. I'm going to go into sulk mode. I'm just getting so tired now. My uh, PSN is Mitchell hyphen hyphen Morgan. Forgive me for some reason uh, Stream Elements does not want to work tonight. So the Discord and the PSN is not coming up. But it is Mitchell hyphen hyphen Morgan. If you want me to send me a friend request I will gladly accept it. Okay, well, we're, this is the last one we will know for the future this is the problem when you open up a public lobby it's why I don't do it very often uh, you're always going to get some issues Teal, Welsh boy and era still going for it aren't they Air is going up the inside. Has he got Welsh boy? Or has he gone too deep? I can't see. No, he's not done him. Welsh boy's still there. I'm pushing the track limits because I just want to try and get close to these guys, see what's going on, but they are going for it. I think we've I think we've got ourselves another nice little driver in here my guys I can't drive for toffee now I'm I can't even remember what corners I'm on
That said, I am approaching 24 hours of being up. But there you go. At my age, when you've been up that long, you're going to make mistakes. Oh, and another one. Another big slide. And another penalty. But, uh, oh, but I appreciate the, um, the feedback. If we were going to be doing another one, it definitely would be happening. That's another penalty. What was that in the chat? Yeah, he's out of there. Baz is a good guy. I'm not having anybody say anything bad about him. The other guy's an idiot. And I don't care if I get in trouble for that. And I probably will now. Probably get a weak span now. No worries, Faz. I don't have a problem with you doing that. I trust you. It's a problem when we open up a, a public room. The problem is sometimes we find really good people. I was loving watching uh, Era and Gamer and uh, Welsh Boy going through it there, and it looks like Welsh Boy's lost out. That looked really good. I'd love to get Welsh boys uh, feelings on that. It looked like that was a really cracking race all the way through there. Unfortunately, I couldn't get close enough to watch it. Um, but unfortunately, we are going to get one or two bad apples, I'm afraid, in um, when we go public. Thank you, Welsh boy. And... Um, A boozement ride, if I assume I'm spelling, saying that, pronouncing that correctly. Uh, welcome to the community, my friend. Welcome. Hopefully, you will race with us again at some point. Is at some point. And thank you for the apology. There we go. Sorry, a Welsh boy for them dies first time driving these cars. That is what we're all about here. There's a new guy that's come in. And he's straight on it. He knows exactly what we're doing. Rock on, my friend. Rock on. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Right, I'm Queen Crackers. Um, I had two stonkingly amazing races with Jackie, Dakota and Playwright earlier on in the Super Touring Car Championships. Um, apparently, apparently... Um, who am I supposed to be kicking, guys? Was it Damasio? Got who am I kicking? But I, I will do it. We'll do it. Um, don't even know how to. Shows the last time. There we go. It's gone. He's gone. Thank you, guys, for your feedback on that one. We'll do that. Although we are finished, but there we go. Yeah, RL, we are done. I'm I'm cream crackered. I am completely cream crackered. Um, I started to stream half past six. Uh, did some practice for Barcelona in the STCC. We had some amazing races. Two amazing races with Jackie Daytona and Playwright. 
Uh, I think I did. I get two fourths. I think I should have got a third. Um, but um, Jackie Dakota got the better of me this time. Um, I put a wheel over the line, got a penalty and he punished me for it. Uh, which was It happens. You make a mistake. You lose the place. You get punished. And that's it. Um, so we're off to um, San I think, for the next one on Friday. So we'll be doing that next week for everybody that is uh, racing uh, in, in that particular championships. Um, so we'll be featuring that a little bit. And uh, otherwise, we got into the, the lobby races uh, with this little Beamer and it has been an absolute blast. We've had the BMW and a few people in the Cozzies and it's just been fantastic. We will do another one. Um, I just said we'll do the Cozzies in a few weeks time. What I will do is I'll do the Cozzies the next time they come up in the used car dealership because obviously not everybody's going to have that car. And I'd like to get everybody in the Cozzies who we can. They're not expensive. And they are an absolute blast of a car. So um, the cat's away. The mouse is playing. The mouse is very tired. Um, but yeah, Joe and Lauren are away, which means tomorrow I've got some chores to do in the morning. Uh, once they're done, then um, I am looking after Coda during the day. But I've got three different streams set up where I'm hoping to do three different sessions of daily races. Uh, maybe one sort of early to mid morning, another one in the afternoon and then another one in the evening through to whenever. Um, Joe and Lauren are back on Sunday, so I won't be streaming on Sunday. Um, and then I'll be back on Monday where we'll be doing whatever. Not quite sure yet. At some point, I will need to uh, pull out the random races for Monday and get it configured. That will be done over the weekend. The Cozzy is in the used car dealer now. Go grab it. Guys, go grab it. Grab it. Grab it. Just do it. Just do it. Um, and then we can get that up and running PDQ. I'll have to get that up on Discord. Um, the Cozzy wasn't in there this morning because I looped. Um, is it really there? Yes. Oh, just, just, just go grab it. There it is. Go grab it. It's only 193, not huge, but it's a it's the most amazing fun car. Um, I'll throw that up on Discord in a minute. Um, wrong one. That's the one I want. Um, yeah, go grab it, and we'll, we'll do the we'll do another Friday special with the Cozzies coming very 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 soon. Anyway, guys, um, thank you ever so much for everybody that's raced with me this evening. It's been an absolute pleasure and highly enjoyable. Um, as I said, I'll be back tomorrow, but we'll be back with the lobby racing on Monday. Catch up with us then nine o'clock UK time, Monday evening. Respectful lobby racing with respectful driving and respectful chat. And we all have a great time. The rooms are filling up pretty quickly now. So if you want to be on around about um, quarter to 10 to that's probably a good time to grab the, the lobby because the lobby normally goes up around about 10 or five to the hour. Uh, but they are getting pretty popular right now, which is good and worrying at the same time. Uh, I just wish I could have 50 cars in the car in, in the race at the moment. I think we'll probably fill them anyway. I'm going to say goodnight. If you haven't already, please smack the like button on the way out. If you're new around here, please hit that subscribe button because that will really help me as well. And thank you to everybody that is a member of the community and who has already subscribed. Thank you so much for your continued support. I will see you another day. Bye.